Yeah, he went to the bathroom because he really had to. Yo, what is up, guys? It is Strawberry here from Tucson. I'm here with my man, Icy Sophie, also formerly from Tucson. We are here to commentate uh, Puyo Puyo Tetris Top 8 yeah. here at Switch Fest. Dude, I'm, I'm excited. La Mirada, California. Icy Sophie here is actually still in the bracket, <laughs> so he's uh, he's a little vibrating, a little nervous, yeah. but he's Dude. looking like he's about to have a good time. Dude, I'm excited. I'm ready. Like, I'm on winter side, too, so I get the extra buffer, so I'm like, uh, thank uh. God. Thank God, honestly, I'm like, I'm so scared to get a lodge on stream. Dude, stop shaking. You're going to be fine. Oh, yeah, Everybody's going to be fine. So, what is up, guys? Puyo Puyo Tetris will be coming your way nice and shortly. Who is our first match we got? It's a Wumbo Dumbo versus a Vanish, I believe. Oh, wait. Oh, they're pulling off because he went to the bathroom. That's right. Oh, no. Bathroom. That's, uh, that, that's a party foul on the commentary. So, Spark. I think this would be Jukin and Mega? Okay. Then? I, All right. Hmm. Oh, um, yeah, there's Mega. Yeah. Right, Mika's so actually like, he's pretty decent. Like he has a Tetris. His Poyo is a little on the like three chain side, but it's like it's still good harassed. And you do swap combos, like he understands the basics of the game. Yeah, I see a lot of that at uh, these events where Puyo Puyo Tetris is here. You have the people who go really hard on Puyo Puyo Tetris. Then you have the people who like play a ton of Puyo and like no Tetris. And then you have people like me who are more familiar with Tetris but less familiar with Puyo. That's typically how it goes because like people like to play their one game. It's like maining a character. You only want to play that one. Yeah. You know, like the other, but Swap Mode forces you to play the other character, so it's kind of awkward sometimes. Yeah, so for those of you who may be in chat and aren't exactly familiar with Puyo Puyo Tetris, I'll go ahead and break down what you're going to be seeing. So they are playing a mode called Swap. So Tetris, everybody's pretty familiar with. Falling game, you want to make lines, get combos. Puyo Puyo, you want to line up colors, and you want them to fall in kind of order so they form chain combos. Every approximately 30-ish seconds, it's going to swap between modes, and it starts on a random mode. Looks like we are about to get into it, actually. 50-50 coin flip. I know a lot, a lot of people will opt for the four-wide strat, which I believe is what Jukin is actually going to opt for because it's just so strong. Like The higher the combo in this game, the more trash you're going to send after a scaled period of time. At first, it's going to start like one line, and all of a sudden it's two, then it's three, then it's four, then it's six. It gets crazy. I think it's capped at like eight, maybe? I don't remember off the top of my head because they patched it a few times. I don't have a hard drop wiki open to check. Here we go. All right. Arrow. Juchan and Mega, let's see it. There you go. So oh, we're Poyo starting side. on the Puyo side. We'll see what they opt to do. We got some double reds coming out first. Uh, Mega's throwing them sideways. Juchan's throwing them vertical. Uh, Juchan really going for that uh, ladder combo. It's one of your more basic Puyo com combo starters, but it's always generally pretty effective. Oh, he got the all clear. He got stairs hellfire. Let's go. That's a lot of harass, and now he pops a single chain. He's going to get extra bonus damage, which has one red level of trash. Meanwhile, he's going to have to build high for Mega, because if he takes a hit right now, look, he's going to take so much trash. There's tons of trash coming out. We have switched to Tetris. Mega is stacking up on the right side, still leaving room for a well, but there's a Tetris coming out, and then the T as well. Decent little combo right off the bat. Juchan building up that four wide, but already very, very high. Needs to start pulling the trigger. L kind of spins in there. T drops. Trying to build on the side, not really getting the pieces he needs, but they're starting to come down. He's not going to die this time around. No combos really being sent into the next side. So we're back to Puyo. Yeah. And the unfortunate part about that Tetris side was that the kind of like trash he had set on Tetris was able to be down stack. So it countered his four wide build because he just got comboed up too high before he could finish. And so now he kind of just like all that work he put in just backfired. And so it's like yeah. the hard part about comboing on Tetris too. Because it's a lot more survivable than Puyo. So that's a uh, trigger block. Juchan cannot pull the trigger on his combo on Puyo's side. And back in Tetris, he is very high up. All it's going to take is a couple of blocks from Mega, and that's going to be Juchan topping out. He's fighting as hard as he can, but he's got a ton of trash incoming, and that's going to be the uh, first round. And Mega was abusing swap combos so hard, whereas Juchan was kind of just like sending trash willy nilly. He's not really looking at his opponent's board. But at the same time, he seems to have like the basic idea of what he wants to be doing. That's a wild place to put that uh, red piece. But I can see the uh, well starting to get stacked up. I feel like uh, going Tetris first is going to really help out Juchan for his uh, four wide strat. Because once he starts popping off this combo, he's going to be sending a ton of garbage. Yeah. Five seconds until the swap, and oh, no. he's he needs to start sending it off now. He's got to send stuff, but he's not. He's instead just going to hold on to it for next time. A little right. spooky. A swap combo might be able to kill him when they go back. Yeah. He's going to offer stairs build again, try to get some type of combo going, hopefully before he can activate four wide and just kind of cover up this push so he can't get swap comboed. There you go, a little bit of harassing. Didn't really cover too much of the trigger, like, but you still have to build around it, so it worked out a little bit. But yeah. there's the purples. Yeah, you want to just slow him down. There we go. Oh. There's a double. 
interesting usage, but here we go. He's probably going to pop the four wide uh, now. He's got to start popping it. Uh, he holds on to the Ooh, line that's piece. Really kind of. Okay, two, three. Oh, no, yeah. just two. Yeah, he read his pieces wrong a little bit. Uh, but he can still go. Unfortunate. You see, there we go. He's got the double clear, but uh, he should. Uh, he's yeah. not really getting a whole lot out of this one, but he's still, he's still got the four wide yeah. there. He can still continue building on it. Yeah, and Mega's not square. really in a good combo place. He's trying to down stack. Yeah, a couple missed drops. The good part for Jukon is like he can still like just start just restart this combo. He's you know he's feeling the nerves. You know you're on stream for the first time today, like it's a, a huge difference to go from hey I'm just playing on the setup in the back corner to oh god I'm on a stream oh. and people are watching me. Big old swap combo. Yeah, that's a fortune too. That's actually oh that's, that's a kill. lot of damage. Oh, that, no, oh it's it? dead. Yeah, usually like two reds is enough to top out if you already have foils on the board, especially if you don't have a chain ready. So unfortunately, just like. Lack of knowledge there. All right. We do have another Tetris start for Juchan, so hopefully this will help him out. These are best of ones at this stage of the game, so it's kind of dangerous. Yeah. This is one round from uh, Juchan being eliminated. He's getting that stack up. He's waiting for a line piece over on the left-hand side. There it goes. He's got his four well ready, and he's going to start digging. There's one, there's two, there's three. He's trying to send it into a swap combo. Oh, a little too late. But, I mean, he still has the four wide to work with. Unfortunately, he has a giant hole for where he needs the square to go. But if, as long as he can, like, not take too much damage on Poyo's side, he might be able to make it work. But here we go. Mega's really looking for some L shapes. Uh, maybe he thought that purple was going to combo. It doesn't actually end up linking up. But he's got a good combo set up here coming. And he's just going to opt for the, e the easy harass. Yep. There's no point in, like... Over harassing, if you can just get the swap combo, you know it can kill and stop the four wide. Because yeah. Mega opted to finish his build. And oh no, double S, he's not going to be able to continue this combo. And the unfortunate part about four wide is like, you really want to at least hit 10 for it to really matter. Yeah. And if you can't get that far, then you might be better off with a different strategy. Yeah. He's ended up, he's like, he's usually getting good builds at the start, but he's just kind of struggling to close them out because, like, the swaps keep happening so frequently. Yeah. He definitely strikes me as the player who, like, who has clearly practiced this, but he's still very fresh. Yeah. But still, top eight first turn. Yeah, top eight on the first tournament is not bad at all. Take Electing those. to take that purple and yellow over to the side here. Yeah. This is gonna, okay. He's always trying to find a way to make a chain because unfortunately like his build is just too much color conflict and not enough to like pop anything else. Yeah. And unfortunately the pieces are really not being fair to him here. He is having a bunch of trouble getting exactly what he needs. Still digging out, fighting to the bitter end. Yeah, the tough part about like learning Tetris early on is like learning to count your pieces so you know what's coming. And but because if you're not counting, you're just going like solely based on Q. Like it's gonna be hard to build around that type of stuff. Yeah. But that is gonna be it with Mega taking it three null. Yeah. Right. It's a good showing still. Like yeah, it's a good showing still. It's definitely top eight of your first tourney is not bad at all. That is a pretty good result. Yeah, like, dude, I wish I could top eight my first turn. I like go two my first one. That, yeah, that's a, that's a bit of a move. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, but I mean, he at least clearly knew Tetrasai. He, I think Poyo, like, he had the idea of basic stairs, but when you have to already take trash on Poyo's side, and you're like, okay, I only know how to start flat, it's, it becomes pretty rough. Yeah, because, like, digging in Poyo, I feel like, is generally harder than digging in Tetris mm -hmm. because you've got to be concerned with colors, whereas Tetris, you can use a bunch of different pieces in a bunch of different p situations. But in Poyo, if you need a purple and you don't have a purple, you're yeah. in a lot of trouble. Yeah, you can get color drought. You can get, like, oh, your chain can completely cover. Whereas, like, Tetris, sometimes you can down stack on your trash for free. And it's like, ah, dude, I'm so good. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, Tetris, like, getting that nice, easy, down stackable trash where you can get a nice little three combo into, like, a Tetris, Yeah, that's fun. Getting trash in Puyo is never fun. I have never gotten trash in Puyo and said, huh, you know, I'm happy this happened. Oh, looks like Vanish actually has been DQ'd from oh, top no, eight. Oh, no, that is... Definitely unfortunate. Not the place you want a DQ. Yeah, it's unfortunately it's like, hey, I'm going to go to the bathroom, and then unfortunately disappeared. But, I mean, I get it, you know, sometimes tournament nerves get to you, and you just like, yeah. especially stream. Like, there's some people just like don't like playing on stream, and I yeah. get it. It's like, it's rough. That or there, there very well could be like a portal to Narnia in the bathroom. Mm -hmm. right, up next, we got uh, Ibuprofen versus Kyobi. Ibuprofen we saw earlier putting in a lot of work on uh, Mario Tennis Aces. And the, look at how fast these Poyos are dropping. Already sending... <laughs> little onesie twosies <laughs> just to cover triggers. That was very rude. How dare you, sir? See, I was really unfortunate because it covered the one spot he needed for his GTR setup. So, 
There's like the mild inconvenience of like all forms. But QB is actually a very uh, well seasoned uh, Poyo player. He plays a lot of champions. He really likes the game. It's his main game. Oh, and here, look at this swap combo. This is going to hurt significantly. Oh, unfortunately. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Well, that was the most delayed swap combo I've ever seen. Oh, misdrop. A little unfortunate, but he can still set for a T-spin off this. I didn't see it. It's okay, though. He still has a good lead. Oh, we see the DT cannon, though. Is he going to get two in time? Because he's about to get topped out soon if he doesn't. Yeah. I like oh, it. wow. There we go. There's a T-spin double. Oh, uh, he's going to cover the triple just because he was afraid of taking too much trash, and he knew Kyobi has a chain set up still, potentially, if he can get dig to it. So you just got to you know, take damage where you can, take the holes, and just hope that you can catch up on Poyo's side. I'm just looking for another massive Kyobi combo. He's got trash in just these most inconvenient places. Oh, he needs the blue, and he can send it if he really wants to. Oh, he's going to uh, He's holding on. Here. He's sending it with a red. Oh, I like it. Oh, it's splitting. Yeah. This is really going to hurt. Oh, and and oh. he's starting to down stack. Ibuprofen is about to take a ton of garbage, and yeah. he's gone. The A chain is just wow. so much to kill. Because in this game, I think for just the triple in general, as long as you get like a five chain and it's not countered in any form, you can oh, just knock uh, someone out. Uh oh. We got problems with the console. They're uh, having a look at the Nintendo Switch here. Sir, I Maybe the, I have uh, lost. Can I have a redo? <laughs> the uh, I'm trying to see what's going on. Oh, Unplug I think it's a desync because they're on wireless controls so and it's getting like blocked. Oh, that yeah. There are a lot of wireless things in this building right now. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Right. Tons of blue and purple early on. Looks like they're going to in another piece of trash. This one perhaps a little less inconvenient than the last round. Yeah. I mean, this time it's just both GTRs from both sides. Kyobi, obviously, more seasoned in how this build works and just like stacking it on. Look at that. That's like another... Almost like that's like going to be a kill chain this if he doesn't counter it. This is a piece it. of art right here that we're watching. It's beautiful. Both of them sending some uh, combos. Starting on that flat Tetris, Ibuprofen building up pretty quick, but he is taking a ton of garbage. Yeah. He's got his cannon set up. Is he going to be able to get to it in time? It's going to be too much trash. Yeah. The he un is pretty, yeah, oh, wow. The unfortunate part of DT cannon, if you're not fast enough, it's not going to counter anything. So it's like you're kind of better off looking for TKI starts or anything that just is a T-spin start instead of like triple or double triple into um, okay, uh, so four one. Okay, so we're seeing a uh, Tetris start for the first time this set. You think this is going to favor Abby Propen? There's a the T-spin double. Because look at how much more free time he gets when Poyo isn't yeah. immediately like bending him yeah, over. Look <laughs> how much trash he sends to Kyobi. That's like half your board instantly. Okay, he's going to go. Oh, he's going to just go for a small combo. I like it. Just try to kill off Kyobi before he even gets to Poyo. But Yobi's saying, I'm not going to die just yet. He takes a good amount of trash, but since it's on the floor in Puyo, it's not that bad. Trash in Puyo is more annoying when it's blocking off the things you've already built up. Yeah, and he's already starting to dig down. And that's kind of why some people opt to uh, wait for the, let the piece like slowly drop after the swap so it can come and be an inconvenience after it's already happened. Yeah. Okay, he's going to get quick four. And it's going to potentially oh, hover him. Yeah, this could kill. He has to take it on Tetris. Okay, he's taking it on Tetris, so he's going to be, yeah. Look at that well. Lord. Wow, that is. That, that is the freest <laughs> well I have ever seen. Oh no! Is he gonna go for a T-spin? Oh, he could have tripled off of it. Oh no, double bis drop. He still gets another Tetris. Yeah, Kyobi is very high up here, and he's only got enough space to work with. He's just barely surviving. Ibuprofen's not looking at his opponent's board. If he looks, he can look, he can kill him right now. Oh, Ibuprofen! My God. <laughs> he gets the swap back. Oh my goodness. You just can't die on Poyo. Just don't die on Poyo when you have this yeah, round. It, this is tense. All right. No, no. Pop the red. Okay, he's got the red. He's pulling the trigger on this combo. If he can just avoid enough of this garbage to not die. Yeah. He's got nine seconds, and it's in the bag. Yeah, Kyobi knows it, too. Like He's trying so hard to find a big chain to save him. Oh, no, he's not going to get to it, though. One second, and yeah. that's a top out. Okay. There you go. We got a game. It got set. not going to be a 3-0. We have a match here. What are we starting on now? It's another Tetris start. Oh, yeah. Let's go. This is perfect. This is what Ibuprofen needs. Get that RNG. Going to go for another DT cannon. I like it. Now, especially when he has time to actually build. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's getting it set up nice. Ooh, oh, oh he, was that, was, that was very scary. He nearly ruined that. Oh, there's such a good perfect clear counter. That way, you can't build up too high, and you can't get the big four-wide combo after the triple setups. Yeah, look at that. QB has to opt for uh, not QB. Ibuprofen has to opt for the Tetris build. All right. So, we're going to see our first play of the set. Both of them starting in a, a shockingly similar fashion, all the way up to like the fourth set of Puyos. Oh no, here comes the swap combo. He's just going to clear one chain to kind of minimize some of the damage, too. Oh no, that's not. 
Yeah, unfortunately, because he opted like tell you, obviously wants to clear the trash, but if you put it on top, you kind of cut like that stuff from falling down. You need something else to clear the trash first. If you want to hit that chain. All right, the swap back to Tetris. There is a nice size well for ibuprofen. Ooh, look for the single. He is gonna get the uh, T-spin. Single? No, it's a good bit. Get the Tetris. Look at that, but Kiwi was ready to counter, and Kiwi's gonna have his own T-spin double to counter his own. Oh no, a bit of drop. raw luck with some of those pieces there. I mean, if you're counting, it's yeah, not luck. Kyobi throwing out his own T-spin doubles now, saying two can play at that game. And it's looking rough right now, like, the DC can didn't work because Kyobi counted it very nicely. And he's just going to cover his entire chain set. Oh, oh man, that is really rough. That's Ibuprofen it. is going to have to struggle to hang on. He's, he's, he's not going to make it. There's yeah. too much trash incoming. Oh. And that is it. 3-1. Kyobi is going to oh. take it over Ibuprofen. But hey, you got the round. So no, no sweeps? No sweeps. We're not taking a sweep here. Yeah, but I'm going to be up next. So I'm going to see if Kyobi would like to come hop on the mic. Mr. Kyobi. Kill me, please. <laughs> In the meantime, shout out oh, to all up. of you who are here watching Puyo Puyo Tetris, whether you're into the game, whether you're into Switch Fest, whether your family member is currently on commentary, shout outs, or uh, whether you're part of the Pokken scene who has been very supportive of me throughout this entire event despite me uh, bustering out in my events. And uh, that horrible incident last time I was in stream, which uh, we're not <laughs> going to talk about. Two missed uh, smash attacks. So who's up next on commentary? Uh, Mr. Narami. Welcome. Oh, we can hear ourselves through these headsets, and that kind of hurt, but it's fine. All right. <laughs> What's a little more tinnitus on top of it? We're good. All right. Okay, I think we're on. Oh, boy. Yep. I yep. probably have to take off the beam. Yeah, he's got to flex. There's a lot of buttons on that thing, dude. That was really cool. Yeah. Yeah, certainly there's. Um, excuse me. You spelled my name wrong. It's, it's with an O, not with an A at the... It happens. Yeah, I suppose so. There, there you go. That's why I picked a basic fruit for my name. It's like <laughs> pe people generally know how to spell strawberry. Uh, or like if I need to translate it, you know, it's a fresa, ichigo, something. There we go. Uh, well, my name is just basically um, both of my names. Yeah, pick your uh, oh. mic up a little bit so yeah. we can hear you. Yeah, I'm a total noob at this. <laughs> it's okay. These, these are some really cool headsets. What are these, Audio Technica? Yeah. Yep. Shout out to Audio Technica. They make a good headset. All right, so up next we got uh, Icy Soapy. Let me pull up the bracket on my cellular device. Icy Soapy going to be versus Meep, and then that is going to send whoever that, or whoever wins that is moving on to winner's finals. Ah. So we are in winner's semifinals right now. We are down to one, two, three, four, five, six people remaining. So I guess oh. you can call this top six. Yep. This ought to be okay. a fun one. Getting the uh, controls set up right now. We've got a good amount of people in the crowd here. Yeah, though it's mostly for um, the Smash Smash um, Top 12 right now. Yeah, we got Smash going on. We got Mario Kart. Is Mario uh, Super Mario Party still happening as well? I don't think so. I think that is probably it, though. It might be happening in another place. Yeah, there's still plenty of people. Like even if people's games have already entered, they're definitely still playing. We still had some Splatoon. We still had Pokémon. Oh, yeah. I've seen Arms. The scene, the arm scene is out here in full force. Oh, you went with the fish. Yeah, I, I'm always down with the fish. Of course, Arl and Carbuncle. I would argue best character in this yeah, game. But I'm more know. for I'm more for I. Did. Oh, are we just randoming. Oh. <laughs> nice. Just uh, shout outs to people who have their switches in Japanese. I cannot read it, but it's Let's cool. See. Uh, That's some, uh, <laughs> well, well, no mid-set coaching, but the set has not begun yet. Yeah. I, th they're, well, I think I they're think trying to set up, like, the uh, settings were wrong. Yeah, they got to set it to three rounds. And, okay. I, and we're off. We are off to the races. Icy Soapy versus Meep, and we are going to get a Tetris start. So Soapy tends to go for this uh, four well. So uh, rather than going for Tetrises where you're clearing uh, four lines at a time, instead he's getting a really high combo counter. Uh, but instead yeah. he's going for this uh, T-spin oh, cannon here. I see. Yep. And that sends a fair yeah. amount of garbage. Looks like me trying to get Tetrises on the way. But oh man, he's been uh, blocked up pretty significantly. Uh, and here comes that four well that I was talking about. Yep. Actually well, opting not to continue the combo well, and instead just uh, switching back to the Poyos. Setting up for the Poyos. Right. We got a little bit of trash for me, but not so yeah. much that it's going to ruin him. Yep. He's trying to get some combo set up, and uh, Soapy threw that out. Yep. He's right not going to make any change this time. Ooh, looks like Soapy's setting up for a chain. 
Yep, and here yeah. we go. That's one, I that's sure two. This is going to be a three. Yeah. And three looking at Meep's, oh, oh Meep gets the combo off oh, just he, in time. He got He's, to two chain, but it's not going to be enough. But he takes all the garbage on the Puyo side, which might help him in Tetris. Absolutely. So, but this, uh, this four well is happening again. Yep. Oh, not a super oh. long combo for Soapy, but Ouch, it's. Meep. I think that was a misplacement on Meep's part. Yeah, yeah lots of garbage coming in. Meep's pretty oh. high up there, and it's at about oh. eight seconds, so he should be able to survive up until the uh, next. Oh. Ooh, got to be careful. Oh. With those drops. And switching back to Puyo Puyo and now now both Meep is both in trouble for both Puyo and Tetris. Yeah, uh, he's gonna try to start digging here, but he's he's oh. getting good pieces for digging, perhaps. Okay, there we go. All right, that's he actually starts off a bit of a chain, uh, just well, enough to he's kinda got an opening at least. Yeah, he has got himself oh, out of the way. Oh no, it his trigger is covered. Again. Oh, this is uh, oh. rough. Oh, and he kinda blocked himself off from those purples. Yeah. Switching back to Tetris, Tetris and he oh, really needs is, to pull this out this TP. Trouble for Meep and oh no! Yeah, ah, that's Soapy, gonna be a no mercy. Just going ahead, sending him straight into uh, second round. All right, roll Where the wheel. We start this time. Back it's to Tetris, Tetris again. again. I feel like these uh, Tetris starts are really favoring anybody who's pulling out, you know, four wides, yeah. T-spin cannons, that sort of thing. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, Meep over here, he's uh, basically been down stacking since the beginning. Yeah. Here comes another T-spin okay. double. Look at all the trash it sends. Oh, Meep already in trouble again. Yeah, he's building up there. However, he is going to make it to Puyo. He's, yeah. oh, oh, wow. Barely, oh. barely oh. surviving to Puyo. He well. needs a quick kill. And quick kills are hard to manage in Puyo, yeah. especially on the it's first round. It's very unlikely that he's going to get that quick kill before before it switches back, like 15 uh, yeah. seconds but left. He, he's setting up pretty well. He's going to have to pull the trigger really, really soon. Oh, oh and that's not what you want to see. And he's got about seven seconds. We're five. already getting a swap combo territory here. Oh. He's not going to get the oh, Puyo kill. He's already in trouble. Look at all this trash he just took and on Puyo. He's that's top, top he down on both boards. That's a double kill Yikes. for Sophie. And that was very fast, too. No mercy right there. All right, spinning. We got a Puyo start this time. Maybe that'll open some stuff up for me. We'll see what kind of uh, right. stairs, ladders they end up going for. Yep, Soapy building a little higher on the left. Meep very much going for those stairs. It's a pretty easy way to set up a uh, two or three or four chain. And oop. Oh, I guess very, he, very I nearly guess messed he was, that up. He was yeah. hesitant, either messing up or hesitant right there. All right, okay. That's uh, going to be a quick two chain just to kind of defend himself a little bit. But he has had his trigger. All right, swapping to Tetris now. His trigger is a bit blocked off. We'll see how he can manage in Tetris. Yeah. There's another uh, T-spin double from Soapy. Yep. And you can see the trash floor is just kind of rising already. And he's really, uh, oh. Meep is getting kind of oh. unlucky with these uh, yeah. L and J pieces. Yeah. Not helping him out much. T piece, he's managing to get a little bit of down stacking. And back to Puyo. Back to Puyo, he's going to need some greens. Yeah. He, needs, yeah. he literally needs a yeah. double green is his only savior here. A great, a green he's got a one yellow. coming. And there it is. Yeah, he's going to dig his way out a little bit. He's not really got any chains he can pop off, and, and there's so not, much oh, trash coming. That's it for me. He's down. And this is still best of one, so that's Soapy sending him to losers. Yeah. Oh, God. Where uh, Meep will be facing uh, Mega in the losers quarterfinal. Uh. So up next, I'm not sure if we're dipping back down into losers or if we're just going straight to winners finals. We're... Uh, well, watching some wiggling. Soapy's unplugging, so it looks like we probably are heading to losers' quarters. So I'm thinking, based on what I'm looking at, our next match is going to be Ibuprofen versus Wombo Dumbo. Oh, Ibuprofen! Oh, that guy beat me in winners. <laughs> yeah, Ibuprofen looking pretty strong, but uh, he's been knocked down by Kyobi. Kyobi, uh, as Soapy said, really, really confident with the Poyo side of things. Yeah. Perhaps more so than anybody else we've seen at the event, just in terms of the amount of crazy chains he can set up. Yeah. Like, I've yeah. not seen Oh, hold as on. A, I just noticed. What have you I noticed? Actually, uh, excuse me, I actually have a Twitter handle. I have, I have a Twitter you gotta handle get your Twitter shout out on oh, there. For Narami. No, for as in the word. Let's see. Sorry. All just, right. We are there back. There we go. There we go. Woo. If you would like, you can follow us on Twitter. He's at 4 I'm at Speed Strawberry. 
But yeah, we're getting set up for our next match. We're uh, guys taking a sip of water. Yep. Getting the. Uh, uh, looks like they want to change the Puyo skin. Change, yeah, change the skins in the game. Uh, yeah. You gotta find Kyobi. I think it's his console. Um, Where has he gone? I saw him going that way, and then he <laughs> vanished, never to be seen again. Oh no! Yeah, that is horrible. Yeah, vanishing is not the like vanished, vanished out of uh, yikes. Losers round one. Again, I'm still pretty confident that in that bathroom over there, there's just like a portal to Narnia. Because uh, I see people grouping up out there, and then I never see them come back. Oof. So like, uh, yeah. Yeah, salute to them that are not coming back. Yeah, have fun in Narnia. If you find my missing socks, please bring them back because uh, socks become expensive after a while. No kidding. Yeah. And we are changing, I think, the skin of the uh, Puyo Puyo game, making it look slightly different. Uh, oh, they, oh, that's uh, also has Puyo Puyo Champions, another good Puyo Puyo game. Yeah, and uh, I'd be willing to bet if we kept scrolling to the right, there's also Tetris 99, which is... Uh, oh, looks like I think they're switching to English. We are switching to the English language, which is one I can actually speak. <laughs> I am very excited now. Uh, awesome. Being able to read just, uh, it helps. <laughs> it helps significantly. Absolutely. Shout outs to literacy, number one skill. Right. On to the shop they go. And yep. Oh, look, they got all the puddles. All the skins are sold, so they just got to pick which one they want to equip. Uh, we got um, what are we like going with? Uh, retro flat, flat comp capsule, oh. capsules, I think. Oh, flat. Looks like it's flat it is. They've gone for flat. Maybe a little easier on the eyes. Some of the uh, Puyo skins are kind of hard to look at. Uh, I mean, there's one where it's just blocks and, oh, that's not fun. Yeah. I, uh, I'm a big fan of Tetris Effect, which uh, came out a couple years uh, ago or last year. I think it was but last year, though. I might be wrong. Yeah, it's really aesthetic, but sometimes it's hard to look at because yeah. there's just so much going on on screen. So we got when Zed, Zed versus O. Yeah, when you're playing this fast, you want something that you can kind of see pretty easily. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are they still going to default? Well, we, we got Aqua in default. I mean, you can't go wrong with the default for the Tetris blocks. And or it's actually kinda, Tetramino, so I'm yeah, sorry. I would say it's kind of hard to mess up a Tetramino, but I've seen it done. <laughs> yep. And right, on to Puyo Puyo, we begin. Yep. Uh, reversing the starts here. We see in a... Oh, Ibuprofen Ibu 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 likes to send out that little one chain just to see if he can get the good luck to uh, block your stuff. Uh, and right, that is not going to chain. Uh, Wombo, uh, there we go. There's Wombo, a chain from Wombo. Wombo gets a two chain right at the start. And it's blocked off a decent bit of ibuprofen stuff. He still has a way in. He's going to need to drop yep. that red. And he drops it off to the side where it's not really going to yep. do anything. Ibuprofen looks like he's setting up Looks like he's setting up for wide, but I guess plans have changed. Yep. Wombo throwing out the T-spin double. That's going to send yep. a Tetris worth of garbage. Yep. Not bad. And speaking of Tetrises, there's one from ibuprofen. And looking to downstack. He sees that he big well. The, he, he, needs a, he needs a line the piece. Box. Yeah, and but now they switch to Puyo Puyo. Yeah, okay. Ibuprofen gets the red, so he's able to start digging. But there's a bunch of trash that's in very inconvenient places for him. Uh, Between yeah. those yellows and blues on the yeah, bottom left, he's got left the is burn really off. He's got the off burn off so the Puyo to get get through it. He's got to get what he needs. He's struggling. There we go. Here's something. Oh, and he's starting to dig. He's looking for you know specific spots. Okay, oh, there's a there's chain. A chain. There we go. That's uh, gonna send out a decent bit. It's a three chain, and it's a swap combo. And back so it to, gives and back a, to Oh boy. Little bit of Tetris damage, but I think he probably would have preferred to have that on the Puyo side. Still digging down. Wombo looking, oh. He's got Might have, is either a misdrop or he's setting something up. He's got the Tetris. Yeah, Tetris is coming out from Ibuprofen. It's slowing down and they're really starting yeah. to, both Oof. are getting pretty high. Ibuprofen very high actually, but he's yeah. got the, oh, oh no, he doesn't no. get it to the other side. It poofs, but he needed that piece. And there's also a good little bit of trash blocking off what he needs to access on Puyo. Tons of Puyo Even garbage more. coming in. He's got a setup on the right-hand side where if he gets the right colored piece, he can start digging pretty effectively. Mm -hmm. But he gets so much trash sent to him from one Wombo Dumbo that he's yeah. uh, oh. getting really... Oh, he's no, his like trigger's yellow. blocked off. Okay, and, well, he's got the dig going just a little bit. It's a two-chain swap combo. He needs the eye. There it is. Tre Tetris. But I don't think Paul might not do much yeah. unless he... Both this. This. Okay, that's not a lot of garbage. Oh, They're both down. Wombo gets the perfect clear. Oh wow! This can be trouble for ibuprofen. 
Yeah, he's oh. clinging on. He's just trying to eat all this garbage and stay alive long and enough to make it to. Oh. He makes it to Puyo. Oh, but, oh no, no. Everything's blocked out. Oh. He, uh, there's IP oh, almost no way. He can, oh, okay. He can dig. He's not dead. He's just really in trouble. Here we go. All right. Not quite a chain. And that's, that's going to be it for oh, ibuprofen. that's it for ibuprofen. Yikes. But that's only the first round. These guys really coming out here slugging. Tetris start. We'll see how that uh, shakes it up. All right. Ibuprofen looking like he's uh, setting up right. some sort of cannon. Yeah, Wumbo clearly going faster than ibuprofen. That's a perk for Tetris. Yeah, going fast, fast and accurate is the absolute way to play Tetris. T-spin from ibuprofen. Going to see some garbage coming in. And that's Maybe. And Seems off like to Puyo Puyo. Off. Puyo. Yep. Puyo Puyo time. Mm -hmm. Got looking pretty, looking pretty solid. Two chain right. from Wumbo. That's going to be enough to be annoying. But he goes but ahead and he triggers it out before the three he uh, chain to counter it. sends it right back in his face. And now it's going to look quite annoying for Wumbo Dumbo. Oh. And on to Tetris we go. Tetris bump. There's a Tetris. Another There's Tetris. Another back to back, and that's a good amount of garb garbage heading to Wombo. There's a lot of really complicated strats you can do in this game, mm -hmm. but sometimes you just need to sling Tetrises. It does yeah. damage. Yes, of course. Hyperprofen not really getting the tiny blocks he needs to dig this yeah. out. T spin from T spin from Wombo. Both on similar garbage amounts in uh, Tetris and Poyo, frankly. Yeah. So not going anywhere yet. A decent size. Uh, chain being set up for ibuprofen. Yeah. He's just got to find the trigger for it. He needs to get some purples yeah. down there oh. in that middle spot. Or chain, yellows. Oh, chain. no. Oh, the everything garbage takes everything off. away. So now ibuprofen's looking to dig out. Wombo sending a nice size combo his way. But we go back to Tetris. And yep, Wombo's going to be a little faster on the up. down stack, and he's got yeah. combos. There's an opening, wide opening for, for, for an eye block. He but doesn't look. use it, actually. He's I guess setting, he's going uh, for the T-spin double. First. And then heading for the combo. It's a quick little combo, but it, it'll do some damage. It'll get the job done. And they're both actually kind of canceling each other out. And there's a lot of garbage incoming for Ibuprofen Wolfen here. And, oh, only a yellow. Only the yellows are open. Well, uh, there now, it goes. Now it's just the one purple, and he's really going to struggle to get that. But he's still finding a little bit. And the green will help him out. But there's so much garbage incoming, I don't know that he's going to survive it. But he's he's got a yeah. I can't not yeah, speaking. Or, I'm just spinning my fingers, yes. which you can't see. <laughs> spinning it, he has stalled it out. Yeah. He's made it back to Tetris, where he stands more of a chance. Nope. And he's digging, but his down stack has been kind of blocked right now, especially by that uh, Z piece. Yep. And he's uh, and looking for that. Okay. Looks like he's, he's getting kind of Tetris. Needs. But one gets sent his way from Wombo. These guys are both slinging everything they have. Yeah. Little tiny uh, swap coming in from Ibuprofen. Oh, the, what he needed, again, blocked out. And so he's trying to stall it out, but he's got but to he's dig. got it, and okay, there it is. Not, not a chain, though. He needs one purple much. piece, and it's blocked oh. out. Unfortunate. That's going to be can it for Can he spin it out? Can no. He, can he, he no. might be able to. No, he oh, doesn't. Oh, no. One second away. And only one left for Wumbo yeah, to get, get through. And on to Tetris we go. Yeah, a Tetris start. Wombo <laughs> building very high on the sides. Yeah. Looks like, uh, the looks shen like shenanigans in full effect. Ibuprofen Ooh. as well. Looks Both like of them going for some cheekiness. Up, gets up a double. There's that T-spin double. Oh, but Wombo gets a triple. And so does Ibuprofen. It's just, wow. That's all I can say is wow. <laughs> just slinging everything at each other. <laughs> And it's like a perfect reflection right there. So lots of trash going Ibuprofen's way at the start, but since it's the start, it's just kind of land on the floor. So not that inconvenient. Wombo's trash is far more inconvenient, just kind of getting into where chains could be and blocking them out. And, and a, simp chain a simple two chain for Ibuprofen. Simple two chain for Wombo as well. So they are both kind of neck and neck here. Getting chains built up, looking for perhaps larger triggers to pull. Yeah, and a little bit of trash falling on uh, ibuprofen side. I don't know. Opening if that's for an eye block, and he gets the Tetris from ibuprofen. 
Yeah, Tetris for Ibuprofen, or as they say in Classic Tetris World Championship, boom Tetris for Ibuprofen. Yeah. Shout out to uh, Classic Tetris World Championship. Those yeah. guys are amazing. Still playing shout, shout, Tetris. Shout out to Joseph for winning that tournament. Yeah, Joseph Sally, young kid, amazing Tetris yeah, player. Yeah, 16 years old, I believe, when he won that the thing. Yeah, meanwhile, Ibuprofen taking a fair amount of damage from uh, Wombo's massive down stack there, but he's got a sizable combo set up here. Yeah, it's a, oh, the garbage. Oh, it the missed garbage. just by one. The garbage he, did stand. He could have had like a four stack or a five stack. Yep. And speaking of four chains, there we go from uh, Wombo. It's coming Ibuprofen's way. He's going to block out just a little bit of it, but he's still going to be taking some garbage. It's still diggable. It's not the worst thing in the world. Swap combo from yeah. Ibuprofen swap combo. is looking for that uh, Tetris there, but he's got some serious downstacking to do, yeah. and he's going to need the eyepiece. He's got, he's got an opening for an eyepiece. He just needs but, it, oh. and he needs to not oh, die. He came pops very out. Late. Just uh, one piece too late. That's Ibuprofen. That's it for I Absolute tragedy being knocked out. Uh. Some of these games, man, they're slugging it out. These yeah. are, like, difficult to watch. Yeah, it's like <laughs> when you're up there and, like, all of a sudden you're getting all this garbage coming right at you, it really gets pressuring. Yeah, yeah this game makes you sweat. This game is concerning. I think between this, Smash, and Pokin, some of the games i played here, this game just makes my heart hurt. <laughs> like, oh, it is hard to keep up because you're trying to yeah. drop a million pieces at once, set up combos, yeah. look at your opponent's screen, see if they're sending stuff to you. Yeah. You're watching the timer. There's so many things going on. And yeah. it's a game it, about it, falling it, blocks, but it, it's really complicated falling blocks. Yeah, especially when, you got, when you, like, you're near to like breaking point. Well, I know it's not really the term to call it for Tetris, but you get, you get my drift. Yeah, when you're about to top out and you're just trying to spin and hang on for just one more round. Yeah. All right, up next, it looks like we're going to have Meep versus Mega, and they are getting set up. Uh, there's pairing Joy-Cons. He's out here playing with Joy-Cons. We've seen a, a number of different controllers. Yeah. Like, you know, know. like my, my, my myself included, use the Joy-Cons for this game. Yeah. Don't worry, we're not seeing actual gameplay yet. Yeah, they're, uh, it's just um, their control setting up. On to the controller settings. Yeah, I've seen a, like, in all these Tetris sorts of games, I see a lot of different controls. I think Soapy's rocking the uh, Pokin controller. It's a Hori D-pad, which is a really nice controller, by the way. And you can get them for pretty cheap. And whether or not you play Pokin, if you like uh, really anything where you primarily use the D-pad, it's a good controller for the Switch or your PC. Huh. I've seen Joy-Cons. I've seen a lot of really big-name Tetris players actually yeah. using the Joy-Cons just because those directional buttons are nice and easily matchable. Sorry, was there a, like a line for open mic over here? Oh. No, nah, these guys are going to be in winners finals here shortly. Ah, yeah, was, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, I was Kyo focused on the Mario Kart. Yeah, Kyobi and Icy Sophie waiting in the wings. We yeah. got uh, Meep oh. and Mega right now. We got Fish with Long Name versus JNL. Suke Todara. Yeah, that. <laughs> you say it better than I do, so I'm gonna let you keep saying it. I. Oh, they they swapped, they, they they swapped. swapped it. They swapped it to the English version. Oh. Anyways, here we go. All right, we're starting on Puyo. And we got some blues. I think they put a card in there because yours is the download copy, isn't it? I don't know, dude. Uh, <laughs> all right, so we're they miraculously set the language to English. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, oh, <laughs> Meep is setting up the stairs for. Yeah. Meep is setting up the yeah. stairs and. Boom! The there's one, two, three. three Do we got four? four we got four, five, five chains. chains. This is going to hurt, but it's going to hurt on the oh. Tetris side. So already Mega is like halfway up his board, but he's got plenty of room for eyepieces. If he can just right get him, there. boom, there's one. And now he's opting for the uh, L piece, J piece, whatever, the orange piece. Fun fact, Tetris piece colors are standardized now across all uh, Tetris games. Ah, so, as part of the so uh, Tetris company's existence. So we got, so yellow, orange, um, purple, green, red, blue, cayenne, all that. Yeah. All right. All right. So back, back down to the bottom, practically starting Puyo over because both of them launched large scale attacks going into the uh, Tetris side of things. Mega getting a nice uh, side chain set up. Me building very high up on the left. Me setting off a chain. That's one, that's two. And just to hopefully Mega, block off a trigger. Two, three. Ooh, a three chain with a yeah, three, three and chain it's split. Oh, is that what it's called? Hellfire, maybe? Uh, Soapy knows more about it than I do. Yeah. I'm a Tetris boy. Poyo's barely my thing. Mega, Mega gets takes the win it. For this round. 
Spinning the wheel, get Puyo Puyo. Yep. Puyo Puyo start once again. Both of them starting on mirrored sides, but making pretty much the same moves. Uh, Meep is going slightly, he's about a piece faster, and now finally they've started to diverge, but they another really built the same thing another sideways. Another setup, I believe it's a, a large Meep. two chain. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. Meep damn. getting significantly Takes blocked. Up. He's gonna have to dig. Wow, okay. Oh he my. doesn't really set anything off going to the other side. Yep. He's gonna need a good piece, but we're into Tetris. Yep. Tetris. Meep building uh, what looks to be a three wide well. Yep. Mega getting it built up on the side here. He looks like he's going for a four is with a cannon. Is he setting up for a two wide? Well, okay. no, I guess not. All right, so there's a uh, kind of block off for Meep. Mega is going to send in with a swap stall combo. The, stall the eye block for swaps. But here comes Meep's massive chain. So oh. three, it splits, four, five. What a counter. We get five. It's two that red gra escape, trashes. Two That's going to hurt. That is going to take a that big That might tool. actually just kill him. Yeah, that's look, it. Here it comes. That is Mega dead. Uh, so one round meet, yeah. one round Mega. He you was are one yeah, one. That yeah, was an extreme was combo. Meep was blocked like throughout that section, but then he managed to bounce back up. That's amazing. All right. All right. Yeah. Here comes the setup. Meep again, uh, going for this time looks to be a two wide. Mm -hmm. Mega doing a similar thing. I think he's going for a cannon. He's or set, or no, there's or a four well. Or going for all the Tetrises. Yeah, he's setting up that four. I don't know when he's going to start pulling the trigger on it, but uh, Meep starting to send yeah, some preliminary burn, burn damage. Oh, Boom, there's from. a Tetris. One, two, three. three. And on right. to Puyo Puyo. So that's a little bit of starting garbage in Puyo, but starting garbage is not as bad as later game garbage. So Mega getting a cleaner setup than Meep, definitely. But Meep doesn't seem too perturbed. He's trying to figure out what to do with these reds. And uh, not going to pull the trigger yet. There's a little bit of garbage coming his way. A, four, so here comes a five one, chain two, from Mega. Three, four. So four being fired back from yeah, Meep, but he's Meep, so Meep high him. up. And he is going to die. <laughs> oh. This is really, really close. No kidding. On to Tetris, here we go. All right, this is a Tetris start. Don't really, we haven't really seen too many of these just yet. Yep. Meep a little shaky on the start. Mega going a little faster, and he's going to start sending a little bit of garbage. He's really doing a lot of spinning. I think I've noticed uh, Mega's really spinning mostly clockwise. Uh, that's cut. I don't know if that's. That's significant at all, but that's what he's doing. Yeah, and like, he's like, like a little for bit. times you can't you can't spin one way when, when it comes to T spins. All right, Meep going for stairs. Meep Mega going, going for a skyscraper build. Yeah, that's but a Meep's gonna three get, chain. Meep's gonna get first. Only and that's a open. lot is covered up, and he can't really get to the other side, so he's got to go for the red first, and that's not gonna chain. That <laughs> might not. Nah, it's not gonna do anything. But it starts a swap combo from Mega. Oh. Yeah, so good little swap combo. Meep is quite high up. Gets the eye piece. That's going to help him down stack. He's, He's it's really up getting some good luck with those pieces here. Yeah, Mega is all the way down stacked. Meep. Yeah. Oh. Meep has a little more potential combo game when they go back into Tetris, yeah. if they go back into Tetris. But these... Combos are starting to look a little scary. That's a two chain yeah. from Mega. He's going to block a lot of Meep stuff, and there but it Meep doesn't block the trigger. Stair chain. Here comes three. Here comes four. four is five. that five? Do I hear six? I do not hear oh, six, but five is going to hurt. Mega. Three, five. Yeah, he's he's got to stall it out. He's going to make it over to the Tetris side. And it moves, transitions to Tetris, but and it now, doesn't kill him. <laughs> Tetris has gotten sweaty. This is a scary situation for both players. It's really going to come down to what pieces they get, how they use them. Mega looking a little more successful on the down stack right now. Meep is yeah, struggling Mega for good pieces. Oh, Makes it over the side no. just barely. A Mega. Drop on Mega's part, I oh, man, Mega is struggling, but they're going to make it back to Puyo. That piece is oh. going to poof. They're both so high up. And yeah. Meep already has a huge combo ready to go. Let's cut determine the round. Three. So that's just a three chain. Two. And now the... Mega's going to try and send it back. Not a lot, but he's 
He's still in this. He's not dead. But yeah. they're about to go back to Tetris, and that's going to get spooky. Yeah, they're both going to send out what damage they can. It's going to be a two chain from Mega, and, and I'm not sure from me. Two chain Ooh. from both. So it's just Ooh. who's going to down stack better and faster. Oh, and, and Mega takes it. Mega takes the series. Wow. wow. I got to clap that up. That's impressive. That was a slobber knocker of PPT. <laughs> that was a difficult fight. I did not think I would hear that term outside wrestling, but apparently I do. Well, you know what? Wrestling is just good, and it's fun to watch. Yeah. And so is Puyo Puyo Tetris. They're exactly. very, very different, but yeah. you can have slobber knockers in both of them. Yep. Exactly. Now, if only I could find a, a reason to scream out, by God, he is broken in half during <laughs> this. Uh, Never can tell. We are definitely about to see uh, a heck yeah. of a match in winners' finals. We got Kyobi yeah. and Icy Soapy coming in. That reminds me, imagine imagine a Puyo Puyo Tetris match commentated by JR and Jerry the King Lord. That would be amazing. That, uh, I'm trying to think who my favorite people to commentate PVT would be, because that would be up there, but also maybe like Tasteless Nartosis from StarCraft. That uh, would be good. Or uh, Toby Wan and Cinderin. I could see Toby Wan losing his mind over this. Uh, I don't know. I like me. I hope other people like me too. Yeah. Shout out to me. I'm, uh, I'm okay. They're getting their controls set up right now. Right. I'm trying to see what controller Kyobi is using because I know uh, Soapy uh, is rocking the looks like control. Looks like Joy-Cons for Kyobi and... Joy-Cons. What's his uh, Joy-Con swag? He's got a gray on the left and a pink on the right. I dig it. Uh, I, always, I, always, I always wanted the, the pink and green Joy-Cons, but I'm scared that the ones I buy is going to drift. Yeah, though, that is the thing. Never really consider that. All right, we got Rulu and uh, oh. oh. I've been seeing a lot of O's lately. O's in this tournament. Yeah, like in this mode, the character you pick really does not yeah. matter. Yeah, only party, only like um party mode where it matters and fear from Puyo Puyo champions. All right, here we go. We're starting on Tetris. Kyobi on the left, Soapy on the right, and man, these pieces are coming down really, really quick. T-spin single already on the way from Kyobi. Oh, Soapy missed drop. He's <laughs> looking Ouch. for that four wall and not getting it. Oh man, this uh, well, he, he's well, it recovering like he, well. He's makes some mistakes, and Soby's slowing down for a T-spin. There it is. He's got Soby's really good at seeing what pieces he has next. Nice. Another T-spin from Kyobi into a combo. It's gonna be a three combo. Oh, but Soby didn't make switch. it in time for a swap combo. And Kyobi going with the aggression on the Poyo side, just trying to give yep. Soby a decent amount of trash and know where to put his uh, combo starters. Oh, this is a two-way. Anyways, anyways, um. Considering from the match we got, well, right, Kyobi, uh, this combo looks scary. Yeah, and Sobe, here we go. There's one, two, and, two split, and back, back oh. to Tetris. I feel like Soapy kind of holds the advantage in Tetris here. Yeah. Gets the IP down stack, not quite a Tetris yeah, there. Yeah, Tetris from Kyobi. Soapy's still digging. A T-spin single. Got another Tetris coming from Kyobi. And he's got a good place to drop a T-spin single, a mini yeah. T-spin single, but a mini T-spin is a T-spin nonetheless. Yeah. All T-spins are, uh, it doesn't matter the size of the T-spin, it's how yeah. you use it. Uh, but yeah, Icy soapy has got a good size combo on the way. Yeah. That does not start it. He needs a purple piece, and that green piece is kind of in his way now, perhaps. But you know. Oh, a simple, All right, here a we simple go. There's two one, chain, there's but, two. Oh, Soapy is red. He gets rid of the red. Yeah, he managed to dodge some garbage. He actually is going to start his own combo. Yeah, oh, here. but the red's it's back. It's just a two chain. The red is back. Oh, and this boy. is going to hurt in Tetris, but, he but he's not Tetris. dead. He's got his own Tetris. He's not able to get that piece in. Oh, oh wow, he, he does. does. There oh. we go. Took a while, but he got it in. Yeah. Kyobi's so still sending a fair amount of garbage. Going. Soapy's clinging to life. But man, oh, here Ooh. we go. There's some down stacking. Kyobi getting back. really high up. Kyobi's dead. Soapy takes the first Way round. Go. Wow. That was, uh, Sobe was looking a little shaky there in the first part, but he manages to dig it back. Sobe's Tetris is yeah. impressive. Oh. Sobe uh, already setting up for a T-spin. Building his shenanigan wall. Oh. That's what this I'm calling it from here on out, because I don't know if it's a double or term. triple. Oh, yeah, no, his T-spin cannon is oh. primed and loaded. Here we go. Boom. Double there's right the double. There. And he's got another T on the way. There it Boom. is. Boom, there's a Just triple. Just a triple. And another spin. So... Kyobi managing to fight off a lot of this garbage with just straight up combos, and now Soapy is actually going to be the one taking trash into the Poyo side of the round. And here comes even more garbage. More gar swap combo began for Kyobi. 
Oh man, a this is a swap. lot of trash heading Soapy's way. Oh, oh man, no. that is dirty. Nine nice. seconds, and Soapy's trying to build stuff rather than stall it oh, out. But no. this perhaps a mistake. He's well. This is two it. one. Oh, uh, that's he doesn't it for quite Soapy. make it. One and one a little, little overkill on Kyobi's part. Now, as a reminder, we are starting the best of three section here. So, whoever wins this uh, overall game is just going to get a point, and then we're going to carry on. It's going to be the first two points. Ah, cool. Oh, he didn't get the O block. It's perfect, perfect clear. Tension. Perfect clear for. And already Soapy is really hurting, but he's got T spins. Oh, this could hey, be bad for. He's got the square. He's just. Okay. He's surviving. He's got to fill it in. But that's what he's doing right now, is surviving. And they're about to head over to Poyo, which is, again, more Kyobi's game. Kyobi takes a tiny bit of trash going from yeah. Tetris to Poyo. Things are looking pretty smooth, but... But oh. he gets a Tetris swap combo. And, and so that's going to really... Uh, he clears okay. all that garbage it, out of this way. Yeah, it forces Soapy to spend his, like, setup combo on recovery rather than actually going. Uh, Soapy trying to get some sort of combo built up before they uh, swap back into Tetris, yep. where he is... Uh, He's got a really good down stack option here. Oh, big he just, opening. Yeah. Big opening okay, for he just an needs an eyepiece. Where is that eyepiece? He is, is in it? a drought. It's coming. It's on its there way. It is. There's a misdrop, though. Unfortunate. Oh. I guess, I guess he, he, he recovers warm. quickly. And now he's got the down stack. He is no longer sweaty in Tetris, but he is definitely sweaty in Puyo right like now. He's setting up for a T spin. There it is. He's got the T spin. He's going to send some uh, garbage over to Kyobi's side. But man, look at Soapy's Puyo board. He's got a lot of digging to do. However, he does get it started. Yep. Here's a two chain. And he and sets up another. There goes another two chain. That's a one, that's a two. Yep, not two a three, but little twosies here and there are going to get him down to oh, not dying, which is where he wants to be. He's got, he got countered by um, Kyobi. Oh, that is not where you want to be. They make back it to back where, to Tetris. Back to where he began. lot to watch here. Soapy starting to try to set up a well rather than just down stack. Kyobi looks like he's just down stacking for now. Looks like Soapy it's Soapy got the uh, T-spin set up. Oh, he's not getting the T-spin. Yes, it's not. It's it not was not made to B. It was not made to T. So made not T. <laughs> Soapy's got a lot of digging to do. He's going to take a little bit of trash here and there. Just two pieces. But, man, there's so much digging that needs to happen. I know. Okay, he's got a two chain. Again, these yeah, little two Kyobi, chains are keeping Kyobi's him in this. looking pretty scared with the setup. Two, One, three, four. Four. A four That's chain. a four chain. So and he's got I red trash. On red. Is he going to make it? He makes it over to Tetris, but he's going to have to take this trash in Tetris. However, but his, he, he his down stacking it. is so good. He shakes it right off. Three and there's a three They're combo. both making combos, but Kyobi's got the better combo on him. All right, Soapy sets up the T-spin. Uh, he's, he's trying to set up a well of some sort. All right, back to Puyo, where it is, again, a uh, bit of a struggle for Soapy. Kyobi sending off another sizable chain. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's no, three, that's and it. And that's Soapy taking another hit. Uh, All right, Kyobi won away from winning this round game match or whatever we're calling it. Soapy uh, still needs two, and it's another or Puyo game, start. Or game for te tennis rules. Oh, well. uh, I unfortunately don't speak tennis. All I know is Mario Tennis Aces is a really good game, and if you don't have it and you do have a Nintendo Switch, I recommend it. Anyways, back to the match. We got um, Soapy sending off a little onesie. Okay. Just slightly too annoying. It actually goes in a pretty annoying yeah. place for Kyobi. Three, a three, three, a four, four, five chain five for, five chain for Soapy. This and is actually red garbage. Yeah, but, but Kyobi's hitting Kyobi back. Looks like, Kyobi looks like he's going to fight back. So and he does. It's a with seven, a seven chain. chain. So Soapy ends up and taking oh. the garbage from Boyo. Soapy now. But yo, T spins though. T spins though. Exactly. Oh, but the they, they might not the be coming fast enough. Not. He's got a lot of down stacking to do. He's making it. He's living. Oh, oh missed drop. No. Oh no. Accident. And that's gonna be Soapy taking and the L. Kyobi takes game one. <laughs> game one for Kyobi. Oh. Oh, whoops. Did I go too hard on you? Oh. Yeah, I love the characters in this game. They talk so much trash for no reason. Yeah. They're not like the we're, ones mashing the like button. Going to jump straight to, to game two. Poyo again, Puyo. right? So, uh, similar start for both players. Yep. They're both reading their pieces in a similar fashion. Look how similar it is. It's just Kyobi is so much faster at dropping down these Puyos. 
And looks but, like, okay, it looks like it's pretty slow for Ice. Yeah, yeah they've Kyobi, diverged Kyobi. a little bit, but Sophie's going to send out the first little bit of damage. A, four a, a five, five chain on Icy's part, but can but Kyobi might be able to counter it back. It looks like he is. Oh, man. Five? Yeah, six. six this is going to be like an eight. Seven. A it's seven. A, it's a seven. So that hurts, definitely. But yeah. again, Tetris is where Sobe's been making his A comeback. perfect clear on Kyobi's part. Oh, man. Sobe is oh, barely so hanging oh, up. Oh, he's down. that was a quick one. On Kyobi's Tetris. I've been kind of sleeping on it. I know he's mainly a Puyo expert. But I mean, his Tetris is not to be yeah. underestimated. He is sending out. Easy, easy. Oh, so the one, the root, Okay, the all clear for both of them coming out, there actually. There are like three, actually. I, I thought, I thought Sobe might have missed the all clear. All right. Yeah. Okay. Little and bitty oh, onesie. Oh, Kyobi took advantage of the took advantage of the all clear better than yeah. Sophie. Already a red garbage for Sophie. And, and oh. Everything is covered. Not good. So on his Sophie's work part. is gonna have to be done in the world of Tetris. Right. Fortunately, no real swap combo to worry about for him. Oh, setting baby. up the T spins and setting up. Yeah, here comes another. Is triple a t on. T spin triple. A Tetris on Kyobi's part, but the T-Spin wins the situation. Yeah, T-Spin triple does more than a Tetris. A T-Spin double and a Tetris are approximately equal. Although I would argue a Tetris is a little easier to get. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, there's a Tetris coming through the side, and that is uh, yeah. Soapy's going to have to start digging here. I don't know that he's yeah. going to make it because he's, he's taking oh, so much garbage, oh, and it just keeps be, coming. That'll be it for Soapy on the, for this Enjoy round. On to round three. Kyobi just needs one more. Tetris, we go. All right, a Tetris start. We've been seeing a lot of Puyo starts. Uh -huh. T-spin single. Triple. Jinx. There you go. <laughs> now I'm the only commentator. <laughs> you and there's a triple as well. Uh, Kyobi taking a little bit, a decent bit of garbage. Oh, wow, tons of garbage for Kyobi. No kidding. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> And all right, Phil Swift. Okay, yeah. Flex tape is going to barely hold together this game for Kyobi as they are going to make it all the way to Puyo. <laughs> and on to, on to, on Yeah, on to the Puyo. And Kyo, look how fast he's setting up these combos. Yeah. Sophie is thinking about him. He's uh, being yeah, a little meticulous. Kyobi's like, boom, boom. I know what I want. I am painting the piece that I see in my mind. Happy little trees all over the place. And this is a deadly looking chain we're about to see. One, two. Two. Just two. Only two. But I see Sophie. It looks but like he's trying to make the swap combo, and there it is. Yeah, both players are going to get up the swap combo, so we'll see who ends up taking more trash out of this. And oh, Kyobi, Kyobi is stacked up super high. Tetris on and a Tetris, is that going to kill? No, they, they swap them back. They both got Tetris. And here comes the digging. So many rock punches on Rulu. Oh. All right, there's a the Tetris for Kyobi. Mm -hmm. Sophie getting things set up. Not and much to work to Puyo, with on Sophie. Not much to work with. Well, Kyobi baby. again throwing out those combos just as soon as they switch, and now Sophie's got to dig again. He's just he's been shovel in hand this entire like Puyo set. Like when it comes to Tetris, he can do damage. When it comes to Puyo, he's just trying to survive. Two chain One, on two. Sophie. It's gonna maybe get him out of the woods just a little bit. He's trying to find any sort of combo game he can. You oh, know, it's a little hole in there. Through this uh, double on, double trash. And I block two combo, three combo. But but Kyobi's got a yeah, lot of work. He's setting up with. that well though. He's setting up the well, but he's having to start down stacking. He can't get the well going because Kyobi's sending so yeah. much garbage his way. Yeah. Man, he had a lot. He has more to work with than Icy Selfie. Oh, many Tetrises, Tetri. I don't know what the plural of Tetris is. All red garbage onto on Icy Selfie. Yeah, oh. only a two chain. That's not gonna recover him. He's oh, that he's in this, it. but he's gone. Kyobi takes it. All right. Oh. All right. Kyobi yelling out, I better see you in grand finals. Well, that takes that takes that was like upset. That takes him to grand finals. All right. Soapy will be dropping down into the loser's bracket where he will be facing the winner of our next match. It's gonna be Mega versus Wombo Dumbo. Uh, I'm not sure if we're rolling right into it or if we're gonna have a little bit of a reprieve, but no, nah, they're they're stepping up. It's time. Yeah. No, nope. no breaks on the Puyo Puyo Tetris train. We are just rolling. Oh man! 
Meanwhile, we got some Smash Brothers going on on the main stage, or as I like to call it, the other stage, because yeah, they're not shoot, doing Puyo Puyo yeah, Texas. Like we got Shuton versus Komei. I've seen so much Shulk this tournament. Like, yeah, it's impressive. We got, we got Komei, Nico, um, I don't know who else. I only know those. I, I, may, I mostly know Nico the most. That's fair. All right, so this, uh, this match right here is going to be our last best of one. So, again, very short amount of time. These guys have three rounds to figure out who's going to grand final or who's going to losers finals. Yep. Pro controller versus Joy-Con, and the characters we got Amity and Amity and Zed. Zed. <laughs> that scene. Canadian English. Yeah, I do like the way they uh, basically made yeah, like characters every, out of every Tetris piece. All the Tetris characters are well, Just their piece, name piece names. And all right, we're no. starting on Poyo. We got a red, purple, and some green stuff. And they're both putting them in slightly different places. Again, I've seen Mega tends to go higher in Wumbo. I've seen, you know, go yeah. a little more sideways. Mega's trying to go for the bigger, as in, like, the size amount of Puyos in the chain. Right, and a simple, a, a simple three chain from Mega. And not to take, like, when we call these three chains simple, like, if you have never played this game before, getting a three chain the first couple times is a little complicated. Yeah. Learning these complicated build strategies is definitely impressive. Just as well as these, uh, you know, your T-spin combos and those sorts of things. And uh, Wumbo does appear to be setting up for a uh, T-spin. T -spin double There's a double. Oh. I don't know if that was a misdrop. But that could have been. Oh, not looking Mega good. Mega is having to hit back a little bit. He's mainly down stacking at this point, trying to get down to some semblance of safety. And we're back on the Poyo side. And it looks like we got a little bit of a, a double double chain. Oh uh, man! Here comes one boat almost combo. There's a one. There's a two. It's just also a, two. a two. But he gets but a he three. He sends a one with it. But he's still he's taking damage from he Mega. He takes still. the damage from Mega with the Mega with the longer amount of Puyos in the combo, and another three chain from Mega, which will will trans yeah will translate. Yeah, to that's here. coming over here to Tetris. It's gonna be three lines of garbage followed by two more. The garbage is stacking oh. up for Wombo Dumbo. He's got to start down. That might be a missed drop on Mega's part. Uh, oh, that does not that look Tetris. Like that does not look T spin on Mega. Did not have it. Wombo Dumbo looked like he's uh, setting up for the back to back Tetris. He just needs two eye pieces. But that piece is yeah. going to poof, and Mega we've gone back to BBT. Mega looks pretty empty on his board, though I suppose it's better for him. Yeah, one more double getting a combo set up. This is going to be a two chain, but it also get a little bit of the garbage out of the way that's been uh, pestering Another him this two, entire a two time. Two chain from Mega, but, but two chain from one Dumbo right back at him. And All right, Mega, and and instant and Tetris. Mega's got to get a two chain on the on the Puyo side. Uh, so much garbage oh. heading Mega's way. This is going this to is hurt. Going, He's is, fighting this, it off so well. This is a lightning round here, folks. Oh man, and he Mega tops out. Unfortunate for Mega. He's like, yo, I need my phone. <laughs> Give it back. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> All right. Again, another Puyo start. This yep. time we're going with some blues, some yellows. Some yellows. Red, Both of them reds. building in decidedly different ways. Mega, again, going for this kind of high into the right. Wombo basically making a square of it. Um, nothing right. uh, being launched yet. They're both more content to set up a more complicated chain. Here's our first launch. It's One. coming from Mega. There's going to be a four chain. chain from Mega. But Wombo but Dumbo was Wombo ready. Here comes Wombo One, beats two, it. three. Wombo beats it with a four chain. Yeah, it's a four chain that's split, but man, both of them coming to uh, Tetris eating a fair amount of damage. Wombo down stacking a little less successfully than Mega. And Mega looks like he's going to be the one to be able to set up his first amount of damage. Here comes a Tetris. Tetris and right back from Wombo. It's nonstop. You just can't say words. They just keep throwing stuff. Exactly. And we're already back to Puyo, where yeah. neither player has much on the board. Wombo's got more of a start uh, with combo. Just one, one so far. Can you make time for a two? And looks like it's not going to happen. All right. What? L little bitty chains. Wombo Dumbo does have some uh, really unfortunate garbage and some annoying spots, but he's managing to clear it out decently. Mega, Mega, Mega taking the trash. And on to the Tetris we go. Oh, no. That could have been a missed drop on this part. All right. He's got to dig. He needs some green or he needs some uh, tea. He's actually going to opt to do it with the uh, L piece. 
I'm having such a hard time remembering names, and they're literally just shapes. Yes. I mean, the only obvious ones we have is... Uh, he spin oh. triple. That was obvious. That's yeah. obviously the solution to send a ton of garbage Mega's way going into the Puyo Puyo oh, side. Mega, Mega looking troublesome in both parts. And here we go. Here's a start of a chain. It's going to be a two that splits. And Wombo sending it right back at him with uh, extra garbage packed in his lunchbox. So and here Meg it comes. Mega, Mega throws some out, but it's not. Doesn't manage to block the trigger. He just needs a blue, which he's not going to get before they start Tetris. And, man, he's got to dig hard. Oh, Tetris on, Tetris on Mega. Oof. Operation Downstack. Is it going to be successful? He's still oh, no, hanging on, but no. No, that's not enough. All right, Wombo. Needs one more round to take it. Mega has got to pull it back three to two. But we've got a Tetris start. Things are different this time. Not every day is the same. Yeah, leaving uh, two spaces to the side over there. Wombo has set up the uh, T-spin. Well, he got multiple T-spins yeah, set up. Hard. Yeah, it's going to get There's one. crazy. There's Here a T-spin triple and another. another Yo, he could take this out right now if he's, if Mega's not careful. Mega fortunately gets the down stack. He had a couple Tetrises. He's going to be going to Poyo, but man, that was a hairy start and Wombo some gets trash with for, love. Wombo gets some in time for <laughs> the swap. Thank you. It just takes all the words out of your mouth. There's so much going on at all times. One, two, two with the it's split. split. And Mega trying to send it back. He's still going to take oh. a lot. That is going to be hard to go through. Yeah, he's going he to need a, a, a large drill for that. Yeah, at this point, a shovel is not going to suffice. You need a tractor. You need a backhoe. You need one of those massive, <laughs> like, and construction equipment things, some steamrollers, employees. Everything to get him out of that situation. Yep. One bow is digging down. He's looking for some T so he can do some T spins. Mega and is I just am. down stacking. He is trying to live at this point. And he's got... Uh, opening. And he closes it with a T, but. All right. A little bit of spinning. Just trying to stay afloat here. He's getting One, a little bit of digging done. Two. One, two, and three. So well, trash heading Dumbo's way actually room. lands. That's the thing now. Wumbo has got a lot of digging to do on to his speed. side. He's going to have to speed through this in order to get out of it. All right. Here comes another chain. Oh, just a one chain from Mega. Whoopsie. And yep. Okay. Oh, can, Both of them are. Well, that is a swap combo coming out from Mega, but not from oh, Wombo. But no, wait. And the recover. Tetris. He got it and back. And the two combo. It's all good. Whoa. <laughs> I, I'm not even sure what's happening right now. It's just pieces are falling. Combos are happening. And now Mega, who's been behind pretty much this whole set, has got Wombo a little oh. bit on the ropes. They're both just They're down stacking everything. This. It's like fast as lightning. Is this Puyo Puyo Tetris or Initial D? Here comes a chain. Oh, no. No chain from Wumbo. Trash going to Mega, though. If it were Initial D, the music would have to be replaced with all Eurobeat and stuff. Yeah. I think this game could use some Eurobeat. The music is way too calming for the amount of stress happening on the screen right now. I take with Knight from Knight of Fire. Okay, and uh, here we go. Wumbo's got that swap combo inbound. Both oh. of them do, actually. Five from Wumbo, oh. five from Mega. Oh. The garbage oh, is stacking up. Get, is so oh, high up, but it. he's got the can right pieces. It? Mega is digging. Can, he is oh, alive. Oh, no. That's it. Wombo moves on to losers' finals. Wombo moving. Wombo Dumbo moves to the losers' finals, but uh, you ever see those three O's that don't look like three O's? <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that? Wow. Oh, my God. <laughs> you, you should have looked at the screen like last second. Just hey, Wombo, Wombo, hey, hey, Wombo. He's in the zone. He's yeah. in auto zone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so B wants his run back. He's saying right now well, he wants Wombo, the run. Wombo, can you show us that control over here? I think he missed it. I missed it. Yeah. <laughs> what do we got? Look, all right, turn, turn it back. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> uh, let, let's show the. Story, so <laughs> okay, no, here. Tell the, tell the story. So I put the sticker on for good luck uh, for Smash, and then a week after I put it, my my control stick started drifting. So I can't use that pro controller anymore for Smash. Sakurai cursed it. You didn't run it through his uh, copyright policy. You used his uh, used his image without asking. I think that's what it was. That's why you cursed your controller. Uh. <laughs> 
Well, oh, that, was, that was the case in 2013, I believe. That is a. <laughs> yeah, I was like, it was. Yeah, it was like melee that got banned. Well, that banned was from I was streaming. In college. <laughs> like, that was a yeah, long time ago. I'll be honest. I was not into the Smash thing until like late, like late, late Smash Four, and I gotta thank, I gotta thank one of my friends from Philadelphia for game for you know being him. He's like a melee player. He got me more, more into the melee scene. Like, I like. Oh, don't get me wrong. I'm into Ultimate way more than Melee, but he made me like you know accept Melee, accept, have a better acceptance in it. Yeah, my thing about Melee and uh, Smash in general is I've got to that point where my reaction time is so slow I can't enjoy playing them, and especially not Melee because Melee is crazy. They've Those. become it's like watching football for me. I yeah, it's a spectator sport. Yeah. Same with like your MOBAs like Dota and League because I know yeah. I'm not I'm never oh, gonna find four people that click. I see like, Soapy pulling out Satan here. Dark Prince, Soapy's not messing around. He has enlisted the literal devil yeah. to uh, help him win at Puyo Puyo Tetris. Oh, Kyo, oh, Kyo, oh, Kyo. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. You Satan, you Satan. You say you stand. I <laughs> see. Anyways, sorry, it's I'm looking at this Twitch out. Anyways, here we go. All right. He's dark. He's known as Dark Prince here in the English version, but in Japan, he's known as Satan. Anyways. Yeah. Shout outs to Japan. They don't censor that. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, here we go. All right. Well, Soapy Wombo. gonna send the first chain. That's well, two. That's three, three. That's four. That's a Wombo five. firing it right back. But 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 Wombo sends a bigger five chain, but. Oh, that's enough. And, that's and it enough. swaps. Look at all this blood. That was enough to send him back. Oh, crazy. Look at how much trash Sophie has to contend with when they go back to Poyo. Got to be careful with those drops. He's got the Tetris. <sighs> Setting up uh, some sort of T-spin. There we go. There that's the double. An opening for an eyepiece, buddy. Instead he uh, But there is enough. That's there. not a Tetris, though. Boy, but it is going to go for the uh, swap. It's a three-line swap, and now Soapy is digging. It's shovel time. Shovel time, and Shovel Knight's not even in this yeah, game. Yeah, shout-outs to Shovel Knight. That is a great game and a great character by yeah. a great company. Yeah. I'm just shouting out everything. Shout-outs to shout-outs. Yeah, yeah, folks. Um, shout-outs to no shutouts. I hope we do not see any shutouts going forward now that we're down to best of three. Anyways, on to the... Oh. Soapy, he's uh, looking oh. to set he's up another T-spin. Here comes, nope. not and gonna and have it though. Oh, oh, he's Jesus. on the ropes. As the, oh, it's my my mic wrong. Oh. Thank you, thank you. You sir. are a little louder now. There we go. Right. Soapy is gonna die. And there goes Soapy. Satan not helping out on this uh, first particular round, but it's round one, and we got yep. a Tetris start this time as opposed to a Poyo start. Yep. Sorry, I'm just putting yep. it in my head. Here comes the uh, T-spin setup from Wombo. Soapy yep. sets up a T-spin earlier. Yep. Yeah, I'm getting ridiculous. Anyways, um, let's see. Uh, T-spin on a uh, C-spin triple on. <laughs> oh, over there. We There's so much happening all at once. Soapy is getting the stacks. Here, he's got uh, eyepiece. And on to Puyo Puyo we go. I see Soapy. Not gonna get any combos out of it. Neither player is gonna get a swap combo. Ice is gonna go large here. A One, large three. Two. That's a thick three right there. And Wombo is taking a lot of trash. That's like half his board is now gone. No Soapy with the heavy Puyo offense. Four. It's crazy how much difference there is in uh, comboing on the Puyo side versus comboing on the Tetris side. Yeah, combos are way more deadlier in Puyo Puyo than in Tetris. Yeah, you interrupt their combos on Puyo, but you just take away their time on Tetris. One, one, two, three. A four swap combo for Icy Soapy. Yeah, and that's half of Wombo's Tetris board gone as well. It's a little easier to get Tetris and, board and, back faster. And he and Icy's speeding through this. Yeah, he's down stacking quick. I Sorry, I probably right. spit it right there. Anyways. Back to the Puyo Puyo side. More garbage on Wombo's side. Yeah, he's digging. Soapy takes one little tiny piece of trash. He could probably recycle it, but you know, yep. you, you do what you must. Yeah. And he's looking Some to set up a chain in spite of it. And <laughs> All right, so this is going to be no chain. No chain from no Icy Soapy. Those tiny little pieces of trash really polluting Soapy. Tetris for Icy Soapy. 
Wombo is really high up there. He's got to start getting that down stack. Fortunately, he does have the pieces for it. And oh, Soapy is Soapy looking, Soapy's looking for the bottom of the board. He's, uh, but but Wombo's coming back up. Yeah, Wombo says no. Wombo says and no. Back to the Puyo Puyo side, where we're seeing honestly similar situations for both players. Yeah, dead this, even. They're heat. going pretty long over here. One and a two that splits. Swap combo from. Yeah, swap combo from Wombo. It's a hefty swap combo as well. So, one big Puyo incoming. And digging started, but we're already back to Tetris. Okay. And oh, Soapy Tetris is just digging Soapy. so much garbage in and he's deleted and it ICS all. And ICS back on a normal board. Okay, we, we've hit the reset button for Icy Soapy. He's down low. And Wombo has and old. Wombo, and Wombo Wombo's got to dig. He's got to dig fast, and he's got to dig now. Oh. He's in a hairy situation. Oh, Icy's looking for a Soapy tease. is ready uh, there to it is. get the but, kill. Oh, he'd run out he of time. He can't spin it. Oh, oh, no. The garbage caught up to him. But all right, Soapy, does he have a chain here in Puyo? I see some stuff set up. There's a lot of trash in the way. That, is that yep, going to stop him? No. It stops this chain. It stop. No, OK, we got well, a, we got a, two, a chain. two chain. It's just enough. But now here's more trash, blocking off literally everything once again. This pollution, man, it's really uh, hurting Soapy's environment right now. He's going for a Tetris, getting that build up. This is still Wombo th has got combos, or does he? Tetris. Man, this is, the, this is just the same round, Jesus. Yeah, we have not even gone to game two. We're not even gone to round three yet. That is crazy. Wombo's and so Wombo's high up, but he's going to live. Oh! Wombo's going to have to try to survive through this. He, he is not going to make it if they go back to Tetris. He needs a kill now, but he doesn't have a chain big enough to kill. Yeah. There, he's going to get a three chain. That's going to hurt Soapy, definitely. But Soapy's going to start digging yeah, so, back. So, and Soapy's main and goal is to just send it back to Tetris. And two. And one. There we go. Soapy takes this round. Right back, and there we go. A little luckier that time, and look at that sigh of relief. Yeah. <laughs> Wombo Dumbo looking fo focused. Soapy emotional as ever. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, I mean, you may have best of three, but that first lose is not going to, is going to make you feel a bit weird. Well, weird's yeah, not I mean, the word to describe it. Yeah, it's, I really like, Unfortunately, I don't know much about many of these players except Soapy. Soapy, I know, is extremely dedicated to his games. Like, when he was super huge in the poking scene in Tucson, he would, like, walk to work every day in the blazing desert heat uh, and come back. We'd have set up, we'd have an attorney Wednesday nights, because it's the only night he had off, like, at his house. Uh, and then he moved to Northern California just because, like, hey, guys, I want to be good at this game, and there's more good people there. <laughs> So he, when he gets dedicated to a game, he's for it. And so he definitely cares a lot about this match right now. He wants to make it back to uh, grand finals, and he wants that run back with yeah. Kyobi. Oh, Soapy takes There's a, a lot, lot of garbage. There's a lot of garbage, though. He's going to have to fight for it. It's one and one right now. Yeah. Oh, Soapy's not looking too Oh, man, he's got a lot of, uh, a lot of interesting holes in stuff that he's got to patch up here. It's very cheesy. And he just keeps getting squares. These O's, are pro these O's are a problem at this point. He's had, he's had to waste so many good line pieces because there's just squares yeah. everywhere. And now back to Puyo, back to digging. Look at all this trash he's got to get through. But there's a one chain, there's a two chain. That's going to get rid of three of it. That's and, not and, how and English and works. I don't care. <laughs> Setting up and another not quite a chain. Wombo, gets a, Wombo a gets a two chain of... Wombo gets a two chain over here. Yeah, Soapy gets a three, another, though, so Wombo chain. keeps the garbage another for now. Another two chain for Wombo. But, hey, back to Tetris. T-spin. Oh, well, not true. Not, not quite. Not a true T-spin. So high up. And that, like, we're having altitude sickness right now. It's got to be cold up there. Okay. Slams down that uh, eyepiece. And that one as well. Soapy still digging. Wombo looking for the bottom of the board. Soapy looking to stay alive, getting back to the Puyo. Kyobi over here, sort of near us, shouting out some words of encouragement. Two chain from Wombo. Soapy going to take a little bit of trash. One, two, three. Not that bad. Uh, He's still got to get his chain going. Oof. Both of them are uh, setting yeah. up sizable chains, which they're probably going like, to let let go I can, like, right now. Soapy oh, actually doesn't get Wombo one going. Wombo gets a large three chain right there. Yeah, it's a 
so close to the top, and, and there Soapy goes Wumbo. tops out. Wombo is going to take the round. Only one more for Wombo. Up 2-1. If he wins this one, he's moving on to loot. He's going to move on to Grand, I believe. Yeah, whoever. Actually, no, because yeah. this is the best of three. It's two out of three sets. So if oh, he wins yeah. oh. this, he gets a point. I, for, <laughs> I forgot, like, that second round lasted way too long. I forgot where we were. Yeah, there, there is going to be some high blood pressure by the time we are done with this set. Like over hundreds, like, man. Yeah. Soapy, he's throwing them out. That's a one. There's just little ones here. But every little one that he sends is going to block something of Wombos. Look at those pieces right there. One, two, three. They are very much in the way. Soapy setting up some shenanigans on the Tetris side of things. Wombo getting perhaps a little cleaner build, but he doesn't have that T-spin double, and that eats up a lot of space. And a T-spin triple. Ooh. Oh, Not baby, bad. a triple. Oh, those MLG memes. I love my classic memes, dude. That's what it's about. <laughs> They're digging. I, I, Soapy looking for the bottom here. No, it makes me wonder. Was, did someone ever made like an MLG meme on this game? Probably not. It was probably dead by then. Now, I've seen a lot of memes of uh, Puyo Puyo Tetris carries the FGC. There's a lot of good videos with that title of some insane yep. stuff being done and in this Wombo game. And Wombo takes severe damage right That's there. That's a lot of garbage. Oh. That is so much trash. Oh. Is, only Reds are going to help him Wombo out now. Does not. Oh. Okay, not quite. Yeah. Digging down, Wombo's looking for the bottom, as is Soapy. Oh, Starting to get it. He's, he's, he's got a T-spin set up. Oh, so much trash coming in. Oh. Vital scan. I mean, vital scan. I'm trying to remember these lines. A disaster from Icy Soapy. And he's made it back to Puyo. I was oh, watching that with bated breath. Only going to help him. Oh, Wombo is so stacked up. And oh no! So oh, oh it's trash! No. Oh! Oh God! All we can say is oh! Oh! oh he, he's Seven not dead. Left. Wombo is not dead. He's and gonna he's be digging. And now it's gonna go back to Soapy, who is oh. so stacked up. Oh. Wombo's in trouble. He's gotta try. He's gotta try to kill him. He has to kill him right now in order to win this. Yeah, Soapy is not looking the best in Tetris right now. He's super high up, but he can dig. He's A got triple. the right pieces. Uh, ooh, so close. Another triple. It, this is anybody. Oh. And he managed to survive. Taking the, the win. pop off. It's two out of three. That's two out of three, folks. <laughs> <laughs> well, Wombo with the, the premature pop off. Oh, that might bite. That <laughs> might bite his bottom right there. Ooh. That's going to feel hey, awful. Still, that that set alone was worth popping off. That, oh, that right. game alone. Uh, Yes, yes, folks. This is not the Wumbo you're familiar with with Tetris 99. No, this is a completely different Wumbo with a completely different beard and a really cool controller. Yeah. <laughs> True. <sighs> we need some time to breathe, All right. folks. Soapy requires a beverage called body armor. Yeah. Wumbo Dumbo with whatever is in his uh, hydro flask yeah. looking thing. I'm assuming it's water, but it could be anything. It could be. He might be drinking the secrets to how to be good at Puyo Puyo Tetris. Uh. True. It's helped him thus far. Yeah, that, and that, and that, and speaking of drinks, there might, it might be the drinks we might need for main stage because they're handing out free, they're handing out free monsters over there. Yeah, they are handing out free monsters at main stage. Uh, now, now that's in uh, Ontario, isn't it? Yep. Ontario. But it's uh, Ontario, CA, California, not Ontario, <laughs> CA, Canada. No, not Canada. Do not book your ticket to Canada. <laughs> I am telling you right now, please, do not <laughs> go to Canada when you're mistake. trying to go to California. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with Canada, but main stage is not there. It is in California. Yep. One person is still going to go to Canada on accident. 100%. I will bet $100 right now. You heard me, Twitch chat. <laughs> yeah. Somebody's going to Canada. Be fun stuff. And here we go with round two of this. All right. Round two. Wombo is uh, up one. Wombo Dumbo. Not other Wombo. Just this Wombo. He's our Wombo. And he's up by one versus Icy Soapy. Both of them setting up their chains. Nobody's pulled a trigger yet. It's always a it's a game of chicken with this uh, early phase of Poyo. It's like and who's gonna go first? And who's he gets an early four chain, and that's gonna be enough to counter back. Yeah. Actually, no, it's Soapy not. Soapy hits off a six. Severe damage, Severe damage on, on icy. Wombo Soapy's Dumbo already nearly topped out, and he's got digging to do. Whereas Soapy's just trying to kill him right now. Is he dead? Is no, he and he, he is, is dead. dead right out the gate. First punch Ugh. being thrown. Soapy. 
taking the first round in convincing fashion in game two. Uh, starting off with Tetris, but oof. Tetris this time. That's a convincing throw. Sophie had started out, you know, sitting there and thinking what he was going to build. Wombo quite quickly going for these uh, T-spins. He's got a well in the center. Yeah. Oh, Wombo, though. He's not. Well, there's the T-spin double into the combo. Two. And Wombo's three. Four. This is a heavy combo. Five coming out. It's going to be six. Wombo speeds And he through might this. have just killed Sophie. He did. And he does. He that, speeds through this like Sonic. Jeez. That is the power of a four wide well. You can start it with a oh, T-spin yeah. and just keep the combo rolling. And there's, unless your opponent did the same thing, there's not a lot they can yeah. do. All right, yeah. we got a uh, Puyo start this time. Yeah, when speed kills, sometimes they mean it. Both players, you know, looks like setting up those chains. Looks chains. like an odd-looking stare, I believe, though. Probably might yeah, be wrong. Yeah, Wombo has got a kind of a stare thing, but it's not. It's, he's only sent out the yeah, one. Yeah, but Icy Soapy's Icy looking Soapy's like already pulled the trigger, though, and that's going to be a five. Yeah. Wombo has hey, got hey, three hey. reds, and they're going to be coming to Tetris. Oh. That's a wow. lot of garbage. That's a lot of garbage. However, he's got an eyepiece coming. He can recover from this. Uh, I, get I the think Tetris right back. I think so. eye blocks can't fix. Well, the yeah, eye blocks are really the flex tape of this set. <laughs> they are just holding together when you know a player might not be able to do it otherwise. Sophie with his own four well is gonna misread the pieces a little bit, not quite get the combo he wanted. And are we having any swap combos? Does not look like it. Oh, there's two. Oh, oh no! That's a Wombo. good amount of damage, and Wumbo wanted that trigger pull, and he yeah, did he not got get it. Yeah, you soft lock right there. Uh, I don't think that's the word, yeah. but you know. so, soft lock as a speedrunner, that word scares me because it has ended a lot of things that I've done. <laughs> you do speedruns? Yes, Strawberry Speedruns, ah. Twitch.tv. Ah. Shout out to Link's Awakening DX and the new one that's coming out soon. Yeah. Anyways, back to the match. Wombo. Both players and looking at and the Tetris. Yeah. Tetris on one but here comes one from Sophie. Another Tetris on Icy. Uh, T spin? T spin single. Yeah. Oh, looks like one was setting up a T spin, and there it is. And we're swapping over. Oh. All right, but Wombo has pulled. Okay, he's pulled a two oh. combo. Got that two chain, but he's got a scary one. He's, he's, he's pulled chain, the trigger. He's three, one, two, four three, four. chain coming. No, wait, five chain. Oh, yeah, yeah four it's chain. A, it's a four chain, but it's a big four chain, and that is going to hurt. That could actually. Oh. He's trying to make it. Oh. One. Oh, no, okay, he survives to Tetris. Still, he makes it to Tetris. But that's going to be a He's hard. He's got to start swinging hard now. He needs damage. Uh. He's looking for that blue piece, not quite getting it. He's having to. come a, very late. Come, didn't yeah. come in time. He's still digging, but he's going to go back to Puyo, and he's going to pretty much just die. Uh, yeah, there it uh. is. And two to, two to one. Two to one for, this, for the round. Wombo needs so one more. He, Wombo he's needs thinking hard. He's trying. He's psyching himself up. Yeah, he needs he's one more. He's got the music the, in his ears. He needs one more for grand finals. Oh, I see Sophie. What's going on he, here? He's scheming up some shenanigan T-spins. He's yeah, really good at making T-spins happen. There's a, a triple, triple right there, just show you. And he's got room for another one. Here it comes. It's just uh, a T-spin, though. It doesn't uh, actually do any damage. Yeah. So yeah, they're, they're both in similar yeah. spots, but uh, Soapy's got some good damage potential coming up. And here we go. Right. Swap Un combo set for Wombo. Uh, unfortunate start. Soapy just a tiny bit behind with that grab it, gar grabage, garbage, English, not good. It's fine. Grabbage the garbage. He's grabbage the garbage, and now he's setting up a chain, but there's more. We're making up new words. There's more grabbage on the way. Here's the chain coming. That is a thick two chain. Also, uh, thank you. Also, thank you. Um, what's it? Um, Reshiram 18. Yeah, Puyo does more damage than Tetris. Up. As in, um, if it's just like Puyo versus Tetris in the case. Anyways, we're back in. Back on the Tetris side. That's not quite a Tetris. This Tetris one is, though. Tetris for Icy Soapy. Wumbo Dumbo Wombo is, is super high up. up. He might not and make it in. And there goes two, two. We have one more round. Is Wumbo oh. Dumbo punching his ticket Final to the finals? Final round for the round. Or is Soapy going to send it to game three? Final round. Boy, did you just and it's a Tetris start. Okay, fair. Here we go. And 
T-spin right. already set up. T-spin set up from Wumbo Dumbo. It is on its way. Oh. Icy Soapy, though, he's got the tall T-spin. He just a needs a T. That might not be true T-spin, but it is. Boom. There's the T-spin double. And the starts a combo behind it, or attempts to. Yep. Looking like digging as we are getting into the Poyo side of things. And a swap, uh, swap combo. Swap set, swap for, set up for Icy. But he ends up taking the garbage. But but, it, but, but Puyo Puyo can make you sweat. Yeah. It, Puyo Puyo, PBT is the sweatiest of games. This game will hurt your soul very quickly. It will raise your blood pressure. If you are not in physical shape, consult your doctor before playing Puyo Puyo Tetris. <laughs> oh, man. Here comes a chain. Be it's true. only going to be a two chain, <laughs> yeah. but only a two chain can yeah. still do a not massive a, amount of not damage. A, not a joke, folks. If you get a heart attack playing this game, that's going to be oh. yeah. Anyways. Please do not cause yourself cardio damage, cardiovascular damage playing video games. All right. Disaster. All right. Boom. Uh, so that boom. Soapy is trying to set up some damage now. He's going to take a little bit, but and it's easier to, to work Puyo with Puyo. on the uh, Tetris side of things. Back to Puyo Puyo. A three, boom. A three, Two. A, a four chain. A four. I see Soapy up, but Wombo answers it before it can even happen. Congratulations, nothing happened. Everything <laughs> and nothing all at once. <laughs> Uh, As the most impressive nothing I've ever yeah. seen. And here comes another uh, three chain. Another three it's chain. a big one, too. And that's how Wombo, Wombo, Dumbo, Dumbo, Wombo He does not another. have an answer for it, but he's going to take it on Tetris. That's the correct answer. Take it in a game where you can downstack by having a single eyepiece like that. Oh. Boom. And now Sophie oh, Wombo, is struggling towards the right top. There. Oh. Sophie is, like, just right up here on the cusp. And Dumbo oh. is trying his hardest to kill him, but they're going to make it back to Puyo. Uh, Soapy looking for is what is the biggest, scariest, most deadly yeah. chain he can pull off. This uh, three chain is a spooky one, but again, well, Soapy's going to take the damage is, from that. Icy is in a bad state, folks. He oh. is trying so hard to hang on. Here he, he goes. Okay, he sent out some damage. It's going to be a uh, two chain for his swap oh. combo. But he here comes the down the, stack. Can he, can he dig enough? Can he dig enough to get Okay, through? he's still breathing. No! no! And that's it. Wombo. Wombo Dumbo will be taking finals. it to grand finals. Soapy taking an impressive third place here at Switch Fest. Lots uh. of claps. Tons of support out here for Icy Soapy. <laughs> Yo, can someone bring me water? I'm, I don't think I'm going to get Jesus. Hey, yo, can somebody get this man some water? Get both hey, of them. Oh, can someone get me water? I'm, oh, I'm getting pretty dizzy over Shout here. Shout outs to uh, the pretty much the entire Pokin community standing right here supporting their boy, Icy Soapy. Uh, hi. Yeah, dude. What's up? Oh. I wish my Discord friends would find me in real life. <laughs> Dude, the poking community is so tight in it. Like yeah. these dudes just is a big happy snuggly family. Uh, we do make it weird on occasion, especially <laughs> in Tucson. Uh, Shout outs to Tucson, Arizona, the only place where you go play video games at the police station. I'm not joking. <laughs> what? Yes. What? So if they're gonna have a second to set this up, I will explain. So in Arizona and especially in Tucson, the drinking laws are very strict. So if you're under 21 and you are in an establishment like where the primary purpose is to serve alcohol, then you can't get in. They card you, you can't get in. Yeah, sounds like, very they, sounds like Dave and Buster's like at past like 7 or 8 p.m. here. Yeah, they're very strict about that. And then we have a lot of barcades where it's like a bar, but it's also an arcade. Yeah. And all of those, Smash thank Brothers you. and other fighting games, thank you so much, were uh, getting kicked out. And <laughs> anybody like under, you know, from the ages of 16 to 20 that wanted to play like fighting games or like Pokemon or Smash or any of that is like, well, man, this sucks. I can't go to my sessions. I can't go to my locals because they're all in bars. Uh, then we had this one dude. I don't know who it is, but shout out to this one guy. His mom's a cop. Uh, and she's like, hey, we have this huge multi-purpose room at the police station that's open to the public. Nobody ever uses it. There's tables. There's chairs. There's, there's like ladders. There's, there's, um, there's out announcer tables. There's, yeah. there's wait, outlets. It's wait, just wrong. a good place. <laughs> Why don't you come play there? And so they started, and then it grew. And now, like, every Friday night, there's, like, about 20 to 30 people playing video oh. games at the police station. Oh, and it's, it's the best venue we've had in forever because it's just yeah. it's clean, it's nice, and it's definitely not in a sketchy area because, I mean, 
If somebody's going to try to steal stuff out of your car at the police station, <laughs> why would you want to do that? More power to them. Like, you, that, that's just impressive. You'd be, you'd be an idiot if you tried doing that. You'd be an absolute madman. 100% mad lad. So um, shout-outs to the police station. Shout-outs to the Tucson FGC. It's, it's a good time. Shout-outs to Ridley. And water, hydration, is very yeah. good as well. So Shout-out to two chemicals, hydrogen and oxygen. Yes. H2O, dihydrogen monoxide, a.k.a. water. Yeah, All I right. Was, I was Kyobi like, is ready, and his opponent is on his way. Wumbo Dumbo is here in grand finals versus Kyobi. Yes. And I think this, this is, is a – we're still using traditional double elimination bracket rules. Are right, we? so are we? Uh, so, that so, means we can, so we can have like a bracket reset. Yeah, yeah. WNL, we have a bracket reset for anybody who's watching. This is not familiar with the way a double elimination bracket works. And it looks you like do a tournament, and you have two lives. You lose instead of being eliminated. You go to the losers bracket. However, because this means somebody's going to make it to grand finals without ever having lost, that person still has to be defeated twice. So he can still be knocked down in the losers bracket, and they just replay. Mm -hmm. So in order for Wombo Dumbo to win, he's got to beat Kyobi twice in a two out of three set, in a two out of three game. Yeah. So if that happens, we're going to be here for a while. Yes. <laughs> you know, speaking of Arizona, I only been to Arizona once. I It was mostly near Douglas. Um, like, you're literally like on the edge of like America and Mexico, actually. Yeah, Tucson is really right there. You can drive down to Nogales and be down there in the border pretty quickly. It's funny that area, like, there's a bunch of old oh, Spanish God. names that got kind of like recolonized, and so... There's a lot of Spanish stuff they say wrong, like and West Kyobi, Texas Amarillo and, and versus the Amarillo. Request, Kyobi goes with Shezo. All right, we got Shezo for Kyobi. Zed still for Wumbo Dumbo. Uh, who's poor, poor Shezo. He got some completely out of context lines in this game. Dude, like, look at Zed, though. You got to love this man. He's an absolute yeah. unit, and he's, he's out a with father it. figure in this game. He certainly is. All right, they're ready. Let's and go. Here we Grand go. finals. Grand Puyo finals. Puyo Tetris. Starting with Puyo Puyo. Let's go. And we're starting with the color yellow, which is Amarillo in Spanish. Or if you're in Arizona or Texas, Amarillo. <laughs> right. Oh, my. Oh, my. It, it oh, hurts what, what so I, much <laughs> when they talk like that, but it's oh, a thing. One of my, fr oh, one of my friends, um, they're from Mexico. Uh, they're we already gonna, got changed. They're going to kill me saying that. Anyways, here we go. Kyobi already taking Look the hit. Look at all this trash. Wumbo Dumbo did not here to come. Well, he did come here to play games. He came here to play Puyo Puyo. But, but he's but not messing Kyobi around. Kyobi answers it with the chain. It's not even done. Six. That's a six chain and one okay, half Wumbo. the board deleted and that's not even all the trash. He's got a down stack. It's still perfect two. clear on Kyobi. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh he's my. already halfway. He's down stacking so hard. He's oh. still got more garbage to take. Jesus Christ, Kyobi, my Help. God! <laughs> Wumbo Dumbo's down stacking was impeccable there. He should have died and he did not. This <laughs> like, man oh. is literally on some zombie right now. He's like, he's like. Okay, and Kyobi's like, okay, he's not even phased. He's just Wombo building up another so, huge stack. He somehow survived with an arm and leg right there. And a four chain. That is limping away on one HP. And here we go, chains. Kyobi's got a red, but he's sending oh. them back. He's, okay, he takes some garbage. An annoying amount, actually. Kyobi, get in the touch A double for a Wombo. Wombo Dumbo. He's yeah, getting a good down Kyobi stack here. through this. Can Kyobi speed through this like last time? Oh, oh too Wombo. high! Wombo takes it. Wombo Dumbo draws first blood. And the blade of Shazzo gets curved right there, folks. It's Sakurai, dude. It's the curse. <laughs> Anyways, on to ne the next round. Starting on Tetris, mini T-spin single. Already, oh, he could have gotten all, all, a perfect clear right there. Uh. T-spin's being thrown from either side, and it's looking like there's not going to be a lot of blood heading into Poyo. This is going to be the first round anyway, so it would end up on the floor, basically. Okay, there is going to be a line coming for uh, Kyobi, so he will annoy Wumbo just a little tiny bit. And here, begin he might get chain. a swamp combo, actually. One, One two, okay. Four this chain. could hurt. This could hurt Ace a lot. And this is going to hurt a lot. Ouch. And... I don't think Wumbo's Shut gonna me up. Yeah, No, he's he's dead. And that's it for Wumbo for this round. There's the kill. All right, 1-1. One, one. Here we go. Kyobi, wiping it off. He's like, okay, got it rolling. 
And some truly really good Poyo coming up from Kyogre. Masterful, in fact. All right, here come the pieces. And here we go. Um, Kyobi setting up that one center wall. Ooh. That oh, no, orange well, is Kyobi. very much in the way. That L piece is not friendly. A but double, turn it double. into a T-spin double. When life hands you lemons, you T-spin on the lemons. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, <laughs> that right there. That is what you do. All right, and heading back. Kyobi trying to set up a swap combo really fast, but not going to get the Poyos he needs in time. Wombo going to send over some trash, just enough to be extremely annoying, in fact. Yeah. And, oh, he's not going to put in the red yet. He does not have a oh, chain for it. There's garbage coming his way, but he's going to have a chain gonna, hitting back. Is he oh, he, stall it? he stalls he's it gonna, out, makes sure it's going double, to Tetris. He's got a double chain right there. Swap One, combo, two. two. Only and two, three, three four. four. A four, a four swap combo. That's not too bad. That's a Tetris on damage. It is so much damage, in fact. Oh. Three, two, one. And, and we swapped. Kyobi is about two thirds of the way up his board. Wombo down on the bottom third. But over here on the Puyo Puyo Tetra side, Kyobi's got a terrifying looking combo ready. And here it goes. Here's the one, here's the two, and it splits. Okay, oh, it was a really big two. That's the biggest two I have ever seen. Gigantuous. Any any ver ad adjective that, that goes with big. Truly ginormous. Shout out to the movie Elf. <laughs> That's just become a word now. People say that all the time. Yeah. It's combos, oh, the combo game. Wombo, oh, Wombo dead. might be in trouble. You cannot downstack this. And that, and Kyobi takes this round. All right. On to round three. Four, actually. Oh, four. Jesus Christ, I can't even ca keep track of those numbers. You saw the two was so big that naturally three came next. Exactly. All right, Wombo trying to shut up, set up some T-spin shenanigans. Here's a double. But mini, a mini T-spin mini. single firing oh, back. Oh, no! Ah, That's not okay. That is ugly. All right, Kyobi, he's, he's recovering. He fixes you it. can't he count Kyobi out. It. And That's look, he remember what I said. Life gives you lemons. It's T-spin time. He's got the T on the way. And but he holds uh, it. He holds it for next time. He has saved his lemon for later. He's making lemonade tomorrow. We are on the Puyo Puyo side of things, stacking it up. Kyobi, Kyobi just knows exactly what he wants to do on Puyo Puyo. Yeah. He's like, okay, I visualize it in my brain. These are my pieces. Here's my stack. It is time to come for blood. And oh. Trigger's kind of underground. Okay, now here's the trigger. And That's going to be at least, a large oh, again, uh, there's a three, four, five. Five plus a split right there. And, and it's swapping. Oh. Ooh. Where's the combo? Here's a T-spin in the combo and the OP. Oh, uh, Wombo no looking for an I, oh I piece. Oh my goodness! But looking for an I piece, but the RNG is not helping him here. He, he's gonna downstack it. He's not dead, but that hurt a lot. And a Tetris, but a Tetris right oh, back no! at him, and he's dead. He, he doesn't had make that it I piece too. Oh. All right, game one goes if, if to Kyobi. Kyobi. If Kyobi can win this, he might he might be the winner, the champion of all. They're, they're, they're both, there's some giggles being had. They have big they're, skins. They're, and they're changing skins. All right, we're, we are changing skins, guys. The fight, Here we the, go. Are changing. You learn your place. Oh, my God, the Dark Prince voice. <laughs> oh. The, the alternative Satan voice. The best voice in this game. Okay, what do we got? We got... Uh, I think they were all default. I might be wrong. We've gone completely default. Oh, no, retro. Sega Genesis, please. Yo, shout-outs to uh, Dr. Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. Also, the, shout-outs to Kirby's Avalanche. Yeah, they just keep renaming... Or, what is it, Tetris Attack was something else as well. <laughs> perfect, perfect clear for Kyobi. I, I didn't spend too much time focusing. He was going for it. Yeah. T-spin on Wombo Dumbo. Both players swinging for the rest. Oh, no. Uh, unfortunate misdraw from Wombo. He's going to have to dig hard to make up for that. 
And these retro Poyos, so classic. Uh, it takes me back to when I had like the Sonic Mega Je Mega Collection. Yo, Sonic Mega Collections. Yo, the Sonic Comics, the um, Sonic Archie Comics, longest yeah. running comic series yeah. in America, yeah. actually. T yeah, too bad. Too bad's game, pretty yeah. cursed now. Look at those images, cause I'm. Oof! Oh! Big oof! Oh my God! We're sitting here talking about Sonic the Hedgehog. Wumbo's out here slaying bodies. Yeah. I was about to say it was a shame because like the whoever drew the Archie comics because you know, uh, art the person that made him kind of gives me nightmares. But anyways, back to the match. Yeah, back to the match. Wow. I I'm I'm still speechless from that. That was an actual yeah. murder. I went, I, was way, I went way too off topic, and, and all of a sudden I missed it's, it. It's okay. We like Sonic, but we also like T spin doubles back to back. <laughs> yeah. We are just clearing it. And uh, there'll be a little damage coming out from Kyobi. Already some trash on the ground for Wumbo, <laughs> but he's stacking up. Uh. One, a one for two, three. This is a four. This is a, a, it's, oh it's a split my God. four. Wumbo. We got red. That's Wumbo is Wumbo. dead. Yikes. From one Dark quick kill Prince, to another. AKA Satan. Yeah, no. It was, we are coming for heads here. We are not playing around. There are no body shots. We are going to knock you out like Mike Tyson. We will bite your ear off. Shout out to Evander Holyfield and his son Elijah who made the cut on the Carolina Panthers football team. And shout out to WrestleMania 14 with, with Mike Tyson included. Right, shout outs to T-Spin Doubles. Shout outs to this actual A game we are commentating from right Wumbo. now. Shout outs to getting really high up with only four seconds left and the Tetris. And, and, and Wumbo the might be done, but no! He makes it to Puyo. He's going to take some damage, but oh, he's got it. Wumbo's going to need a T. Oh, no, he can't have a T-spin anymore over there. Yo, he's got to kill. He's got to kill in Puyo Puyo because he's not going to make it very, in Tetris. This is very yeah. unlikely here. He's, and here comes Chains. Oh, no! That That is bad. He's going to have to go from the other side now. Three. Two, he one, needs a red, one, and he's not going to get the red in time. Oh, wait. Got, oh, oh, no! no! That, unfortunate. You can tell he's not happy about that one. Uh, uh, two wins. Come on, man. I think this is a tournament point for Kyobi here. Because I think this is two out of three. Yeah. yeah. We're not doing three out of five. No, this is tournament point. If Kyobi can kill Wombo here, that is GG. Yeah, as Smart says, championship point. Wombo Dumbo is not playing any games, though. He is getting yeah. set up. I'm saying the same words repeatedly. There's the three chain. It's a thick and three oh chain. Oh my Coming god! Coming to the head. Kyobi's got to start digging now. Ugh, Wumbo is not not dying without a fight. Yeah, he's not letting this one go. He's he's not even clinging. He's still he's reminding us. He's very much in this game. T spin double. Uh, perfect, perfect clear, clear though. On, on Kyobi, this can turn. Kyobi's got these really really good perfect clears. But Tetris all, on Wombo. Yeah, all Wombo has to do is send Kyobi into Tetris with, or into Poyo with some garbage, and that's a kill. Oh, but Kyobi There's got the all chain, reds. Though. Oh my goodness. Yeah, okay, Kyobi is down stacking pretty good here, or digging, or uh, whatever we uh, call it. Kyobi is making, making it, making, making it out that of the comeback. woods. Making that comeback. He's still uh, taking some trash though. But he's digging but he, back, and he I already had a combo set up, so he's just able to dig with few, the combo. He takes a few, and we're about to switch back to Tetris right now. All right, trash coming down for Kyobi. A T-spin single for Wumbo. But he fights it off pretty quick. Now Wumbo's the one with the trash. I'm just watching the trash flip from side to side. 15 seconds remaining. Neither of them going for much beyond the T-spin doubles, which are still doing a lot of damage. But they're just trying to, you know, keep their wits about them, stay alive, get back to Poyo, uh, where yeah. Kyobi's. Oh, do we have? Oh, he doesn't get the line piece in time. He could have had a Tetris going in. Oh boy! There's so much damage oh. incoming for Wombo Dumbo, and it's only oh. gonna get worse because here comes more chains. But 14 gets a red. Oh my! Oh no! Wombo, that, it might be it. He's gotta it? stall is it out. He's got eight it? seconds, seven, and ten. that's it. It is over. Kyobi wins. That's it. There's the handshake. Dark Prince. And get that. Kiyobi takes home the, t the Puyo Puyo Tetris trophy. He, he slumps. He's on the floor. <laughs> he fell down. Pardon me? Oh, part, yeah. That's perfectly, yeah. that's perfectly fine.
Okay, we're hearing about Poyo simulators on phones for practice. They should bring that over here because uh, we want to get that winner interview. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to have to step off. He's going to get him an interview. All right, thank you, Narami, so much for commentating with yep. me, man. It's been an absolute pleasure. Yep. And no uh, this is some good water. All right, everybody kind of uh, surrounding the, uh, the setup over there. And uh, there's money and a medal being awarded to Kyobi. And, and there's uh, Kyobi. Let's go, Davai. Yeah, yeah. All right, okay. Sobi is going to do the interview for Kyobi. All right, here. Have the headset. Thank you, Strawberry. Thank you so much for having me today. Thank you. All right, let me vacate the premises momentarily. Oh. Uh, no, I'm going to go to Tomahawk Tuck for my flight. Yeah, I'll, I'll talk to you after I do this thing. All right, so I'm here with hey. Poyo, Poyo, Whoa, Tet <laughs> Poyo, Poyo, Tetris champion, Kiyobi. I have a medal. How does it feel? I have a medal. Let's go, dude. You get to hold that for the rest of your life. You can take a picture you put on your pin Twitter. Yeah, I, I have a medal. You deserve it. You play well. You play clean. Dude, so... I'm gonna. I got to give you the interview. Tell me, how did pools go? How did you feel about pools? How did I feel about pools? Yeah, going um, into this top eight. Like, were you confident? I, actually, not entirely. When I started today, hmm. I was originally thinking about how I choked really bad at Anime Evo. Yeah. I drowned in pools. When I expected, or rather, the TO who was seating said he expected me to make top eight. Yeah, but see, the, I think they fucked. Oh, so I messed up. Uh, see, the, they made a mistake because they seated Car or low seed. Didn't, even though Kara's been, like, super active. Yeah. And that kind of created, like, that weird issue. It's like, okay, two top seeds have to fight each other in pools no matter what. Yeah, no, and then Kara got nervous. We, we definitely underestimated Kara for yeah. the seeding, for sure. But he said, dude, Keo, yeah, you deserve that seed. I didn't expect you to top it. I'm like, are you sure about that? And I'm like, and he's like, yeah. But, hey, redemption work. Uh, redemption, yeah. Because, <laughs> oh, my God, I'm still remembering how badly I got wash at Evo, but th that's that's in the past. I'm going to be real. I, as soon as I saw that, I asked Carl, like, how you were playing so I could make a game plan. Uh-huh. And I tilted as fuck. Or, God damn, and I tilted super hard. As soon as I realized my game plan wasn't working, I was like, crap, he knows what to do. I can't handle yeah. it. I, I, so clean. I did warm up Friday. Mm. That was it. I mean, that's why I've literally been playing friendlies all day. I played, like, every possible match I could except for one. Yeah, I wish I could have played, played some casuals, but... A oh, guy had, had to do a little stream. Yeah, work. it was like I had to because like the only way I'm gonna beat you is like if I warm up and yeah. you beat me and it was hype. I enjoyed it. It was super fun. But yeah. how'd you feel about top eight? Like looking at everyone, like how would Dude. you rate this top eight? Um, this top eight is pretty sick. Watching, watching these guys get hype over Puya Tetris was pretty freaking sick. Yeah. Yeah. I'll see. Shout out to Strawberry for coming in like on the fly. Yeah, I, I heard you guys when I was over there, and I'm like, oh no, they're commentating about me. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I wear the headphones, yeah. man. Well, unfortunately, I didn't have headphones. Fair. But, yeah, so that was the first time I've been conscious that people were commentating about me, and I'm like, oh, yeah. no, they're commentating about me. Oh, don't no. do anything stupid. Don't, don't do anything choke. stupid. <laughs> don't do anything <laughs> Don't fancy. be at me. You're going to choke. But yeah. I, mean, I got the show off Hachi Spin. That's all I can remember right now. Yeah. Um, there were a lot. There were more people who were more skilled than I initially anticipated for this tournament. That makes me happy for sure. I that mean, means people have been playing. Yeah, I mean, I did a lot better than my seed. Yeah, sixty-two. <laughs> I was sixty-eight. <laughs> yeah, I think. Uh, I'll be frank though. Like that was pretty much random. I just assumed it was yeah, random. Yeah, ha half. I think half the people were random seed. Yeah. Yeah. Because I was like, wait, I don't recognize a lot of these people for their skill. And I don't expect you to recognize me because the only tournaments I've been to were it's final round twenty seventeen. And then I did Isle Storm 2018. Yeah. So it's like, those are hard tournaments to find, too, because they were very small. I didn't even know Final Round had a Puyo Tetris. It second. was super, um... <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Like, Kara, I first met her, and I said, and she's about to play Zyle. I was like, wow, you're about to... She's like, do you think I could beat him? I was like, no, you're going to lose. And then we had the tournament, and that was how I started. <laughs> and then she said, man, she's like, wow, you're really mean. I'm like, sorry, I'm sorry. I just like, wow. honest. And now we're best friends, so... Wow, Kara. <laughs> I know you're watching. Wow. <laughs> 
But now we talk like all the time we're close friends. See, nothing like a little trash talk to like grow the bonds of Poyo Poyo Tetris. I know, right? I, I, I gen I'm, tr you know, I used to try to play the heel, but now I yeah. figured um, I should actually be more of like a mentor type of person. Yeah. Speaking of mentoring, if any of you guys are ever interested in Puyo Puyo, hit me up on Twitter. Maybe. I teach people. I'm down to teach because <laughs> it's, I'm, I won't front. It's a difficult game on the surface. But oh. once you, I, I want to help people grasp fundamentals and make that game click. I feel that so hard because that's what I do uh, with, like, even though I don't play Puyo Puyo a lot, I still study the wiki a lot and I study hard drop a lot so I can yeah. commentate. Because I am mostly a commentator. Yeah. And it's like, and people hit me up. I will teach them. Like that's why we have like the server set up. I have. Uh, I help out some people in Nebraska. I practice with them. Mm -hmm. And like, if you want friendlies with anyone here, I'm pretty sure if you just hit them up on Twitter, they will be like, yeah, let's go. Oh yeah, yeah. Find me on Twitter too. Mm -hmm. Like, I like playing matches. Just talk match shit, and then we'll play. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I'm. I'm more of a Puyo, a Puyo main nowadays. But swap is still fun. Mm -hmm. It's just every time I miss drop Tetris, I just wanna. Save. Well, I see, like I think well, I had like one time where I missed drop three times, and I was like, "Oh, I see. I hate myself." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, like every every miss drop opportunity is a chance for you to figure out a new way to clean up that stack. Yeah, and like that's all it is. Like I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna review that vod because yeah. like I can't say like, "Oh, I tilted off a of QOB, which I did tilt. You, you, as soon as you broke me, I was like, "I don't know what to do anymore, Dad. <laughs> someone, someone take me home." But yeah. it's like you, know, you gotta review that. You gotta look at it and be like, "I lost." Where did I scrumble? It's like for me, I think my biggest thing is the mental game. Like, I think I don't know. If, I think the stream could see me. Like, I was like shaking the entire time. I, was that I controller. actually wasn't looking at you shaking. I was just looking at your play. Yeah, it's like, but it's like on the player cam, you could like see my hand shaking like as I was playing. Oh wow! Like I was that nervous. I like, was. Yeah, me on the inside, like I don't know if it was evident that I was, like, extremely self-conscious about my breathing. <laughs> oh yeah. I was like, yeah, don't, just just don't just don't choke, just don't choke. Oh god, there's a Tetris player. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no, that's all. I get it because like, uh, what's it called? I gasp a lot when I play because I have like, some like a heart condition that makes me like have a harder time getting air when it's stressed. Oh, okay. Which actually makes tournament stamina really high for me. That sounds challenging for you, yeah. Damn. Yeah. And I had to play like almost every set today. And I still played friendlies and showed people how to play. So I was super tired going to this topic, but I was like, oh, I got third. You on, got like, third. Exactly, I got third. Like having to play almost every match and playing constant friendlies. Like I'll take that to the yeah. Bank. That's pretty sick. Yeah. Um, no. What? So, I mean, if I guess if you want any more Poyo Poyo champions actions or potentially Tetris, if you're yeah. in like the Midwest area, there's I have Storm coming up. Storm? Yeah, I have the Storm. That's like the tournament name. Okay. Uh, so it's mainly a Pokémon tournament tournament, but they host uh Poyo Poyo champions and Poyo Poyo Tetris. Someone fly excited. me there, please. Dude, it's expensive. Dude. Okay, my flight to Nebraska was like six hundred dollars. It was like, bro, I flew the three tournaments for cheaper. <laughs> but I'm like, it is like, but if you're close by, it's pretty cheap. But it's just like flying from like California, having to do a layover, it just makes it more expensive. Yeah, that's that's an adventure, all right. <laughs> but then Frosty's, we're gonna see if we can get like a Puyo side event, champions and Tetris, hopefully. Yeah, um, I know Frosty's had one Puyo champ, Puyo Tetris side tournament. I think on the year it was released in the states. Yeah. I think that was like 2017. Yeah, they apparently did it again. I didn't know about it. But I know one of the TOs there were good friends, and uh -huh. I'm like, maybe, maybe I can help him get in a word, and like, so I'd be like, hey, let me do this thing, because I'm trying to go to Frosty. He's like, and I would love to run Puyo Tetris and Champions. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna fight people on Puyo Champions. Same. That's for sure. I actually played hella grinding that game, and there's a clear difference from when I'm playing Japan at like 8 p.m. Uh huh. And then I play in the morning versus the U.S. I'm like, wow, this is yeah. so much easier in the morning. <laughs> and then I play like some like Super 3K Japan, and I'm like, oh god. I am losing. I can't read what he's building. Go back to GTR, please. I just like understand what's <laughs> <Yeah>. happening. <laughs> can, can I actually bring up something yeah, about your play that I noticed? Yeah. Your openings are good. Your mid game though needs work. Yeah. I mean, champions. Like when champions came out in English form was the first time I started learning a uh, poyo poyo mid game. Like so before that, I only knew that basic started for swap. Yeah. So like what? That's like two three months. I think my poyo is like decent for two three months at least. Um, but I'm like, I definitely want to get better. That's why I've been grinding champions like hella hard. Now I think about it. I think I opened every round with an all clear opener, or yeah. I tried all clear openers every single time. And you kept getting. I was like, let me four wide. <laughs> yeah, I was like, there's no way I'm gonna, cause um, what did he was sick? I don't normally go for perfect clear openers that often. Mm. I usually try to go for four wides, 
But my four wides have been very sloppy as of late. Yeah. So that's why I didn't even go for a single four wide this time around. I and mean, that's why I didn't do it. I think I, I think at most I just started GT Cannon in my Lucas finals because like, I couldn't do them against you. Yeah. I kind of like lost confidence in it, and I probably should have gone for it still. You you were having some good DT cannons for sure. Yeah. But it's like, my Hachi spin was like the only reliable setup I had at that point. Because mm. I lost confidence in everything else, and Hachi was my most practiced like opening. But I actually don't like going for perfect clears because I'm really bad at them. I will always opt for oh. the harass. Okay. So that's why like, you never saw like perfect clear after Hachi spin because I like, I just know the triple and double follow ups more reliably than I do the perfect clear. Okay. And it's like, when I, f and you can see sometimes like I freeze to think about like what I'm doing still. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. So like, if I freeze to try to go for perfect clear, there's a good chance I get trash. Right, because that's true. But if I just go for the T spin double, I still get to send harass, and sure, maybe I still take some trash, but it's not going to just to kill my damage output. Yeah. Um. Another thing to work on is like execution for sure. Mm. That reminds me, I gotta teach you some. Do, do you know about wall kicks and Puyo yet? No, actually, no. I, I don't. gotta teach you something after we're done with this stream Ooh. here. Yeah, because like the one thing I really know, like Puyo tech wise. I don't even know if it's a thing or if it's just like a net play thing, but sometimes he's like the Japan players, like they do like this weird like double twist when they're trying to drop to go faster. Oh, so okay. I'll use these Joy Cons to illustrate real quick. So like, if you got a Puyo pair yeah. like this, if you rotate like this, actually, let me. <laughs> so you got you got red and gray, right? Yeah. So if you rotate on down like this, yeah. it it hits the ground. A few frames faster. Okay. So if you have a double, re if you have a double of the same collar, you always want to do a 180 before landing. Okay. Because it locks a little bit faster that okay. way. Okay, that makes sense. Because I was always sometimes like, I don't know why you do this, but it looks faster. It yeah. feels faster. I'm gonna try to do this and yeah, that, that's it. that's why um, like players like to like to yeah. fidget with their pieces a lot because it, it also goes into wall kicking mm. because you push against a wall and then you rotate into the wall. Yeah. And then you just drop oh, okay. it. Okay. Because the other one I know is like where if they're trying to see like your scout trying to read your chain like to do like the double twist like to keep it above on the floor below or the floor up high before letting it drop mm -hmm. to keep it up there so that way they can like see if you're harassing or not before committing to the chain. Yeah. That one's a hard one. I, ju I just realized we're just talking about the game now yeah, instead okay, of yeah, actually yeah. doing interviews. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, are <laughs> we are we going too long here, Mr. Producer Boy? I you don't care. Let's see what time it is. Let's All see right. what time it is. What okay. time is it? Yeah, so oh, it is the last game of the night. You saved the best for last. Yeah. So. <laughs> I mean, so let's see. But Tetris, though, I'm much more stuck on Tetris. Like, that was my main game. Yeah, everybody everybody always says, like, they're better at Tetris because, obviously, we played Tetris for years. Yeah. And Puyo is only finally getting, like, what's the word? Like, uh, it's uh, It's coming up in the West. Yeah. So I forget. I slip in my mind, but I know what you mean. Like, but the, the only thing we got was, like, Eggman's Mean Bean Machine, which was, like, the experiment, I guess. They had Mean Bean and Kirby's Avalanche. Oh, yeah, Kirby's Avalanche. I forgot about that one. I started with Kirby's Avalanche, by the way. Okay. I actually had not played any Poyo until this game came out. <laughs> so, like, I was, like, super far behind, and I'm like, okay, I have to like, catch up these players. I just, like, I keep mad grinding. Yeah. Yeah, there's always uh, Poyo simulators yeah. and Poyo guides you can check out. I use Poyo Trainer a lot, like that one. Yeah. Wait, which Poyo Trainer? Uh, the one where it's, like, you can play, but there's no drop speed. Oh. Okay, okay. So I'll end I, it off I guess we should wrap up the stream yeah. then. But, you know, I guess thanks everyone for watching. Do you have any sponsor yeah. shout outs? Switch Fest? Um, thanks. Check. Yo. I'll, big love to. Uh, how do you. Anime Evo down here? Yeah. Big love to them because these guys bust their ass every year at Evo. Yeah. I'm hoping um, to go next year. Doing all kinds of side tournaments. I actually don't know if I can afford to go next year. Ooh. 